Wait, I almost got it. I almost got it. Oh no. Oh no. Everything is behind and I'm a disaster. Wait. Hold on. Okay. Oh no, I don't have water. Okay. I'm good. I'm Gucci. I'm Gucci. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Hello. Good morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are. How are you all doing? Oh, this is louder than I want it to be. It's like in my ears blaring. Happy Halloween! It's Halloween! It's true! Black Tastic, thank you so much for the gift sub to Urban. I appreciate you. Can we get some hype in chat for the raid, for the gift sub, for having Urban and Black Tastic, two of my favorite humans up in the chat? How are you? How is everybody? How's your Saturday? Mine's a mess. Mine's a mess. If you caught my go live on Twitter, you'll see that I started my day by hitting start recording instead of uh, start streaming. And I looked and was like, huh, it's not showing me my frame rate. It's not giving me the data I want. And I looked at it and was like, hmm. Hmm. I hit the, I hit, I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. I am smart. I am a pro streamer. Remember how I said I get keys for reviews and stuff? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Also, other things are just kind of all over the place. My T is up and... Re Maybe rec is better on mute. I I'm saying, like, oh my god. I, I looked at it and was like, oh no. I'm a disaster. Also, before anyone says anything or asks, yes. You are getting dropped frames. It is not you, it is OBS. Do not be alarmed. Do not go forth and announce it because I'm fully aware of it. It's all OBS, but the show has to continue and I have a game to beat. Also, everyone's a mess on my side of the world. My pizza not here. They said it would be here at 1215. Old girl text me and was like, yeah, they still making your food. And I'm like, it's my cheat day. I just want pizza. I just want pizza and goat cheese. And you are stopping me from indulging myself. Because I got a thin crust margarita and I got goat cheese with marinara. And they're like, oh, I'm not done yet. Where the fuck is my goat cheese? <laughs> I got to say, last time I really like how your hair is out. Oh, thank you. This is my twist out. I want to do a rod set, but I can't because, you know, people not wearing their fucking mask has fucked up all the stuff that my uh, stylist can do ginger Raff, thank you so much for the follow love the name a wonderful play on words hope you're having a good day welcome to everyone from urban stream i am pleasantly twisted i am also a black queer content creator i do the try hard games and the rpgs i am the female mishmash version of the humans i called out earlier of urban and blacktastic because I am both black and queer, and I'm also a speedrunner and a challenge runner. Um, I do lots of hard shit on stream, and then when we're not doing hard shit on stream, we are unpacking what makes games make you tick. So we're gonna play some Momodora today. We actually are outside the final boss. I didn't realize how short, like I knew Momodora was short. I think I'm, I think I read the completionist time and was like, oh, this will take me 10 hours, not realizing that the base game I could do in five. Because I could have beat the game. If I wanted to stay up till midnight last night, I could have beat the game last night. Is a result of gem fusion confirmed. It's true. I am 99% certain that I am a fusion for someone somewhere out there. A gem fusion, a Dragon Ball Z fusion, there's no way that I just came to be. It's not, that's not how it worked. A uh, violation on their part. Ooh. Well, the twist is pleasant. Oh my gosh. Someone said that to me, Talvo, in my um, in my Black Coast workshop. That's how they intro me. And they're like, I have a guest here today. Her hair and her name share some commonalities. They're pleasantly twisted. And I was like... Well then, I can't even tell you how clever that was. How dare you? How fucking dare you? Although I have my Anakin tail here for the twist that didn't work. Um, let's see. It isn't pizza if it has pineapple on it. Oh my god. 
Belated hello, life exploded just as herb rated. You know, I'm I'm feeling that energy straight out of straight out of Nibelheim. Straight out of Nibelheim. I saw this shirt and was like, I think this is mandatory for me to own. I'm pretty sure if I don't own this, I will explode. Um Let's see. Did you see the thing I posted in Discord that now I now keep advertising for Twisted Tea? What? No, you don't. No, you don't. Why? <laughs> it's not mine, though, so it's wrong. Sorry, not only tangentially related. I'm so glad you got picked up uh, World of Horror. Yes! Super excited. It went on sale. It went on sale for the Halloween sale. And then I was buying it at 3 a.m. and PayPal bugged out. So I'm super shitty about it. So then I had to go back and buy it, and it was no longer $4. It was back up to 12 And I was like, I got paid. I'm not going to bitch. Because I planned on buying it anyway, and it's still on sale. So let me just go ahead and grab it. Um, The layers of that intro. Right. 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 And people were just like out the gate like, ooh, the smoothness. And I was like, I can't follow up to that. I can't follow up to that. What am I supposed to do? I thought I was doing okay when my intro of like, what was it? We were doing um, tosses and Drunken Buddha tossed to me and I had to talk about food because he cooks and he's dope at cooking. And I was like, fuck, I can't cook. I bake. Wait, that's the segue. I bake. And then who did I throw it to? I started talking about mukbangs and threw it to somebody who does ASMR and was like, calculate it. But then dude hit me with the pleasantly twisted. I was like, I can't recover from that. Uh, to be honest, we had that a uh, workshop on Wednesday, and I'm still put out by it. I am still, like, in the Yamcha crater, just sitting there, like, dead. Um, I hate it when I get called away from a raid before I can say hi. Always makes me feel bad. Oh, God, I hate that, too. Or, like, um, I've done that so many times where I'm, like, lurking in a channel, and I have to walk away. Like, I'll go use the bathroom, or I'll go get, like, food, and I come back, and I'm all of a sudden in a different channel, and I'm like... How long have I been here? Oh no, it's someone I know. Uh, Should I say hi? Is it gonna be weird? Have I been here for like more than 10 minutes? Uh, I'm just gonna go back to lurking. <laughs> Just popped in, want to say, uh, tell you, Sal and I love the shirt. Hey, Sadie, how have you been? How are you? It's like they recognize I say twisted a lot and interact with tweets of yours containing tea and the algorithm is just nonstop advertising twisted tea to me now. <laughs> Listen, wait for the day that it has like a picture of me on it, just like. Then it's like, okay, I can mess with this now. Hey, Cypher. I used to have this old straight out of Compton shirt from high school that I lost when I moved to a house a long time ago. Mojo, I hate that. Hate that. I returned to Twitch after break from getting banned from chats saying Cyberpunk is transphobic and not letting it go because I'm trans and stubborn. So, hey, friend in chat, how are we doing today? I'm doing well. Professor, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a good Saturday so far. You know, I'm pretty sure there's one that says straight out of bed in this format. I wouldn't be surprised. Still waiting for the pleasantly twisted, twisted pretzels, bake it stream. I've never made pretzels. And it's funny you say that because Buddha right now, this weekend, is making pretzels. I think he made pretzels last weekend. And he made one that he uh, made the pretzel, he stuffed it with short ribs. And so this weekend, I want to say he's making pretzels again. And he's stuffing them with something pork. Ooh, I can't remember what the protein is. I know he's making more pretzels and he's going to stuff some. Actually, I lied. He isn't stuffing them. He just happens to be making something pork and making pretzels again. He's doing another uh, hand at it. I just go, what year is it whenever I host a raise drop when I have to step away because I have no shame? Oh no, I like crumble up and die. I'm just like, is it too late to say hi? You're like that person that shows up at the table, everyone's already got their appetizer and put in their orders and you just get there and you're like, I'm sorry, my panel went over. Happy Halloween, good to see you and I need that shirt. Hey Para, how are you? And I, I forgot today was Halloween. That's how frazzled and scrambled my brain is. I I don't know what time is. Oh, my pizza's on the way. Okay, when we get the pizza, we're gonna get moving. And today I get some stuff from Fan Gamer, which I'm really excited about. It's Dark Souls stuff because I've just admitted defeat, and um, 
I've just given my soul to FromSoft. I've accepted my, my L. I belong to FromSoft now. If they make something like this where it says straight out of Ariandel, I'm fucked. Or like straight out of Ring City. Oh my jeez. Short rib pretzels, where the hell can I get those so I can put them in my mouth? Ask Buddha. He the one who be cooking up the bougie shit. It was an awesome squee, but I meant to say always hi, no matter how long you've been lurking. Hey, Sage. Why you gotta call me out like that? What you mean, Cypher? <laughs> what you mean? <laughs> how did I call you out? Um, I'm strongly considering buying Sekiro because it's on sale this weekend. I can recommend it. Um, it is difficult, but as usual, you have plenty of people in the community who are willing to help. And on top of that, never ever forget that... It is about playing on their rules. If you try to just bum rush into it, you're gonna have a bad time. Oh, sorry, my panel ran late, getting to dinner late. Liz, this is me now. That's that's who I've turned into and I have no control over it. All right, give me three minutes. My pizza should be here and I need to put on my tea. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna put up the BRB screen because I also have to check something I was told yesterday. Okay, yeah, that, that's blatantly wrong. I, I figured that was the case. All right, I'll be back. I'm back. I'm getting situated. Um, let's see here. Still haven't secured water, but that's fine. All of my water is actually sitting behind me. I discovered that the just water is best if it's not cold, which is kind of weird. Kind of weird. Let's see. <gasps> no, my poor goat cheese. I think it's fucked up. I think my box is upside down. I can't even open it. Never mind, we're good. Oh! Oh, wonderful. It's in a container. It's in a container. Oh yeah. Okay. Sorry, like, I'm, I'm just like, riddled with issues at the moment pants were trying to fall off trying to break tos i need to straight out of spoons <laughs> i shouldn't laugh at that but that's pretty good or straight out of ftg i like those i like those uh this can move this can move do, 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 do. oh yeah i should put on my uh fitbit again I was charging it because I ran out of juice and it kept yelling at me to have it once charged. 
All right, let's see what I missed while I was uh, away. I would also buy that shirt. I'll put it next to my sorry I'm late. I didn't want to come shirt. Okay, but Urban. There's a There's a couple of incidents that are like that. Where it's like, sorry I'm late. I was contemplating if I wanted to lie and say I couldn't come. Or show up and just be cranky. Because I 100%, I've been that person before. Where it was like, they invited a bunch of people that I don't fuck with. Or like, they're trying to get me to go to something when I've dropped hints multiple times over. I'm not interested. And then they're just like, hey Vanessa, where are you at? And I'm like literally laying in my bed, looking at my phone, going... Because I'm making that decision right then and there. Sorry, I'm stuck in traffic. Still laying in bed. Goes back to sleep for 15 minutes. Gets up. Alright, I'm going. I'm going. Cosplay buying Sekiro as an excuse to get Talvo to guide me through the game. Fortunately, I don't have a way to patch Talvo into my stream. Yeah, you do. It's called Discord. You use the Discord. <laughs> Gonna head out, help y'all have a grand Halloween. Thank you so much, Sadie. And tell Cell I said hello as well. Wasn't that the lying in bed text that I'm on my way meme? Uh-huh. When that meme first came out, I was like, this is a personal attack. And I don't appreciate it. Because your bitch has done that many times. Where I'm just like, yeah, I'm stuck in traffic. It's me still halfway under the blankets. Just like. I'm on my way. Or the, the most recent one, the Spongebob one, where, like, he's getting up out the chair going, I'm gonna head out. That's an attack, too. That's an attack, too. I'm gonna need people to stop calling me the entire fuck out. And exposing my strats, no less. I'm gonna need people to stop exposing my strats. Let's see, what else are we doing? You know what? I've been good. Fuck it. I'm buying Sekiro. Do it! Absolutely fucking do it. That's my Halloween birthday gift to myself. You damn skiffy it is. Like I said, we got plenty of people who help you. It's a FromSoft game, Tavo. I'm more or less legally obligated to give it a chance. This is why I said my fan gamer package is coming in. I was like, I belong to FromSoft now. There's nothing I can do. All right, let's taste this. I forgot it isn't pizza. I ordered a calzone. So I've ordered a pizza that's folded in half. And it's from a new joint that have really good reviews and their stuff looked like it slapped. Ooh. So let's try it. Hey Steven, how are you? Blanket traffic is the worst traffic. Oh, my God. Like, when they want to come through and they're like, let's get brunch. And I'm like, bet. I throw down on brunch. Let's do it. I'm like, okay, you want to meet up at 9? And I'm like, bitch, that's not brunch. You know that brunch is the, com the combination of breakfast and lunch, right? 9 a.m. is breakfast. That's not brunch. And shit like that, I'll purposely show up late. Because it's like... I know y'all gonna sit there and talk for like eight hours, so I'm just, I'll just see you at 11. How's that sound? You're not gonna come at nine? Nah. Nah. I don't like getting up at nine for work. The fuck make you think I'm gonna get up on at nine because I want to? Hey, mermaid. In this house, we fucks with calzones. I fucks with that calzone. That's dope. Brunch is 11.30 for me unless you've got someone with really good tea and coffee. One of my, um, once this song is done, we're going to switch over to gaming. One of my really good longtime friends that's up in Connecticut. I'll never forget when she first moved there and got her, like, engineering job and stuff. She was coming back to Indiana to visit for some reason. Urban, I'll have to recap you. Um, she was coming back to visit. And I'll never forget the day that she texted me. She's like, okay, how's 8 a.m. sound? And before I even had a chance to hit send on my message, I forget what I even had said. I don't even remember in any way, shape, or form. But before I even had a chance to hit send on whatever I was going to say back, 
another message came in saying, I know you don't fuck with mornings, so to entice you, I'll bring you a breakfast bagel and your choice of tea. Can we still do 8 a.m.? And I just deleted my whole message, and I was like, this is actually why we're friends. It's this this response right here. And she's like, oh, I knew you was about to curse me out. And I was like, yeah, the flames were coming. They were queued up. You was one button press away. Because <laughs> the flames were on the way. 8 a.m.? Bitch, what? <laughs> on my Saturday? Girl, why? Why you dislike me? what I do? But yeah, Urban, I was saying, um, hey, Ken. I was, I was saying that, uh, like, I've had friends in the past who are like, let's do brunch. And I'm like, fuck yeah, let's do brunch. And then they'll be like, how's 9 a.m. sound? And I'm like, But 9 a.m. is not brunch. You know that, right? That's not. Mm, okay. Okay. So, I'm going to do a slight change in plans. <laughs> That's not brunch. You said 9 a.m. So silly. <laughs> Isn't brunch like 11? Yes. Yes, the hell it is. I'm clipping that. Oh, I got a good brownie donut and I'm ready to kill for people. Yeah. Did you get the calzone for Pisano's? Uh, no. And I've never seen Seinfeld, so I wouldn't know that reference. 8 a.m. is... Thank you. I was like, this is breakfast. And also, I was saying that we're doing a change of plans. I'm going to go ahead and beat the game. I'm going to knock this out. And then we're going to reload this. And we're going to do cleanup and then beat the game again. Because I think that's how it works. I think that's how it works. Oh, that's wrong. I have made a mistake. Um, I want that one. I'm sitting crooked. So excited to see how the game is going. Um, we're about to go beat it, actually. Did I not touch the thing? Forlorn Monastery, Subterranean Park. Where the fuck do I need to go? I need to get back to that one that's up top there. I wonder what that is. That's like a straight line, so... Sorry. I'm trying to find where the fuck I'm supposed to go. I'm in the monastery right now. AM is breakfast or the late me meal before bed if you've done a long day. I'm up at 8 AM most times. I may not want to be around people that time of day. I. This is why, like, if I can avoid getting up at 8, I try to. Don't mind me. I'm just bamfing everywhere because I have no idea where the fuck I'm going. How did I fuck up so bad? Yeah, I knew that was going to be wrong. I need the... Can y'all see my mouse? You can't see my mouse. Shit. I need the one that's like almost in the center of my screen. I'm going to get sad. I'm going to get sad. Personal rules, no AM is when I wake up unless business. And I try not to even conduct business on Mondays if I can help it. Yo, exactly how I run my stuff for work. Mondays and Fridays are off limits. Those are my touch bases, loop arounds, clean up, all that shit days. And then if you need to have meetings and shit with me, you got three whole days and 26 whole, 27 whole ass hours to do it. Sitting here and being like, oh, we have to have you right now. Do you? All right, this kind of sucks. The warping is not great. Not going to front. So now we just need to find the one that's like the closest, I suppose. It's not this one. I think this is further. This is the wrong way. Yeah, this is further south. I think I'm better off just going to the beginning, honestly. Is there really not more warp options? Yeah, that sucks. But at least I have some semblance of a warp. Oh, also for people, if you're interested in it, I, um, I watched the speed run yesterday. Mods, may I post a clip? Yes, you can post a clip. Bold of you to think that I have mods here right now. Dear Lord. 
I don't like people, so it doesn't matter what time of day it is. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not like keen on people either. But people that I need to talk to and stuff, I I'm at least willing to get something going there. I do like that. Um. So let's see. Okay, that's that room. I gotta know, was it the sp uh, what was the speed run time? Um, his is from his speed run is actually from four years ago, so his time was forty minutes, and people have beaten uh, the sleeves out of that. His time was forty minutes. That's also partly why I want to go ahead and beat it, because I think I can go ahead and get everything done today. I don't care about poison right now. Okay, it must be below me. There you go. Uh, let's see. The only meetings I'll do Monday mornings are to check in with my team and make sure they have what they need for the week. I like your Watch Dogs review. Great work. Oh, thank you so much. I, I'm still, like, really nervous about feedback on it, just on a general level. Because I think I'm going to do my next review. And my next review, I'm going to do... Um, a little bit more a little bit less scripted I guess we're gonna explore for a little bit where's the review it's on my YouTube it's on my YouTube channel I think this is the only time that this boyo is here I think that's the only time you see this person. Oh, I don't know what that is. It goes here though. Oh, that reminds me to text you a thing. Okay, I'll check my phone here in a little bit. Uh, got a bounce, just want to stop by and say, hey, take care of yourselves, each other. You're important, be safe and love. You have any plans for Halloween? No, this is the first time ever. Oh, I don't care about that at all. This is the first time ever that I've had a Halloween where I don't have plans. Probably because, hey, Ilias, Probably because, you know, people fucking suck. Real hard. Real hard. How are you? Cool, I'm gonna bookmark and check out your review later. Oh, so yeah, it's a good time. I've been enjoying it. Thus far. Yeah, we're gonna just go this way. Oh, really? I'm still poisoned? Yeah, like, this is kind of silly that I can warp all these places, yet I can't actually warp all these places. There we go. There is nothing more adorable than a toddler trying to pick up a pumpkin twice their size. Change my mind. I mean, but you've never seen me try to pick up a pumpkin twice my size. From what I understand, that was pretty cute. Emphasis on was, because this was like five years ago. Okay, so we need to go over a bunch, and then the next time I can go up, I need to go up. Oh, that was rude. Wait, I don't need to do this. I need to figure out whatever her deal is anyway. Oh, there's something down here. Really? I just bypassed this? Huh, interesting. That's surprising considering how nosy I am. I usually go bar hopping with the crew, but no. That's irritating. No one can do the stuff that they like doing this time around. Um, this is perfect. I've been looking for new progressive YouTube content creators. Oh, yay! Well, you, you technically found one. Um, I'll probably just stay in, um, and play Final Fantasy 8 again. Oh, you talking about for today? Yeah. 
That's all I said. I'm gonna beat this today. Oh, so um, going back to the speed run for a second. The other thing about the speed run is there's a thing that he does, where he does like, it's a frame perfect roll. Oh, I just did it! I did it twice. I did it three times. So yeah, the whole way he was doing a lot of speed run was with that uh, roll that I was just doing. So I need to learn how to actually do that. Oh yeah, the frames are gonna drop all day because OBS is just a mess. It's fine, I'm fully aware. It's OBS acting up and it sucks because you know, I'm thinking, I thought about flaming them on um, Twitter today, but then I lost interest in it. Fully lost interest in it. All right, let's get some tea. Let's get some tea. And Urban, did you get a chance to post your clip like you had asked? Or you probably got it when I was like, frozen. Cause you can post your clip that you were looking for. All right. Yep, that's the way he did it. Love seeing you go through the game and break it all down. Oh yeah, so when I was watching his speed run yesterday, it was all about, oop, this is where I need to go up. It was all about this frame perfect roll that he was doing. Because this allows him to move, but also dodge through stuff, if you do it correctly, not like I did. And um, it also, I think I'm gonna try and do something quick on this. But I, I have to get my routing right. And I'd be lying if I said I actually paid good attention to the routing. Wait, did I do that wrong this entire time? Thank goodness resume MS Teams. That's fine. Wow, doing the frame perfect roll actually isn't that bad. Like at all. At all at all black or green tea I'm doing black today if you do exclamation point sip you can see exactly what I'm drinking <laughs> there's also some interesting boxes here too I really hope I'm going the correct way also I learned that I have coordinated absolutely hates hates the um the flying Medusa heads which is you know valid as fuck Yeah, this is right. This is right. That's right, because I'm gonna go through here. Because those heads can literally spawn wherever. They fucking suck. I've been avoiding this entire time. I actually, um, yesterday was inadvertently deploying speed run strats when I was doing stuff like this, where I just move around and charge, and then unload and go. Love the name of that tea, uh, tea. Ravens in a Library. Um, a lot of the teas that Dryad Tea has are actually rooted in songs and or books that she's uh, read. So the, the whole way I found her initially was with um, the fact that she had a tea called Bob the Skull. And that's a reference to one of my favorite characters in one of my favorite books. All right, now we're back on track. So now if we die on stuff, it's okay. What's your favorite tea? Oh God, that's like such a loaded question. I love so many teas just in general. Um, I don't know that I can do one on the fly. I really like her Cheshire tea a great deal. Sorry, I'm like focusing here. I like her Cheshire tea a lot. The Ravens in the library that I'm drinking today is really good. Um. The Cheshire is really strong just because of the fact that it has like a lot of almond extract and almond pieces in it. And I like both of those things a good amount. Oh, god damn it. Get out of here. So I have to do it with like there. 
This game is pretty. It's a very, very cute game. It's true. Um, and I was looking it up yesterday. This game is only four years old, I think. It's a, it's not that old, to be perfectly honest. Okay, I feel like spider sense is tingling. You're a cat. That black dress, a sacrifice maiden. Oh, I'm a sacrifice maiden. Oh, that makes things different. I'm not just a priestess. And thank you so much, Mermaid, for the lurk. I've gotten to try some of her tea. Two of my favorites so far as of A through L and Unseely. Which is funny because I've tried Seely. So how is the Unseely? Is it just Seely but non-caffeinated? Mmm. I'd order this again. And hey, Talos. Hmm. Perhaps even your methods wouldn't be enough to save us. To purely purify his curse, perhaps you would need a special blessing. Hints being given. What the fuck? Do 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 do. Also, something else I learned from Happy. is the fact that you can hit the bell and it'll say, for you fucking asshole, I'm trying to talk to my chat. Unsealy is very good, a bit smoky, very wonderful, and it can hold up to two brews, which I appreciate since I can't always afford tea. Yeah, tea, especially loose leaf, can get pricey fast. So if you're not careful with that shit, you'll find yourself spending a lot of money. But yeah, her teas do really well with holding like multiple brews and all that, which is as you kind of pointed out, a real big plus. Hmm, which way do I want to go? This has more this way. Oh! This is just a save. Okay, there we go. I was like, I feel like there's a warp I was missing. And there is a warp I was missing. It's the castle, which I'm in right now, trying to do the stuff. Do, 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 uh oh. There we go. You suck at your job, lady. I do really wish there was a way to, like, upgrade your damage. Ooh, they trying to get me in spikes. They heard me yesterday when I said I hadn't fell in spikes yet. They're trying to get that spike kill. You love the Unseelie? Unseelie like the court? I don't know if I want that bargain. Oh, oh. There's one that's a, uh... There's one that she has that is a full-blown... Um... Dresden file reference that I was like, ooh, I don't know if I want that quartz tea. Because I think there's like the winter court and then some other type of court. And the winter court, I just read the book that involves them, and shit gets fucking bananas. Like it's a full blown war that breaks out. Oh. Oh, don't hit kitties. I can't get to you, can I? I hate that. I hate that shit. Oh my god, they have little knives. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, that's not right. There we go. We're safe. I think I'm also gonna beat the game because I have something that'll help me find secrets. And I'll run that through in a little bit. I'm having Mario flashbacks. Yeah, a lot of people have been really enjoying the Metroidvania nature of this. Your aim sucks. Oh, Christ. Poisoned by my own shit. 
Okay. That's fine. Yes, I can turn into a kitty. I'm poisoned by my own shit again. I'm really bad about that. I gotta stop walking into it for the sake of exploring. There we go. Also, when I died to poison yesterday, that 100% was the case of what happened. I literally died to poison from my own fucking arrows. Ooh. Oh. Time out. No. Well, hmm. Arkwright, you've played this before. If I beat the game, will it save my progress there and then I can load back up? Just like right outside the boss and go back to exploring? Yes, okay. Then yeah, let's go ahead and get this knocked out. Let's get this knocked out. The longest walkway of sadness. Uh, let's see. Well, this just looks fucking terrible. More kitty. I love how everyone comes in just in time to be like, oh, kitty. Wonder how many vitality fragments there really are. Considering there's an achievement for vitality fragments. Oh, you thought you motherfucker. Goodbye. Oh, wait, time out. This box is empty. This box is empty. Wait. How the fuck do I get back up? Do I have to go back this way? Twenty twenty loot, what the fuck? Yeah, I was like I got bamboozled. Guess I'll go back this way. Uh yeah, so I can't make that. <laughs> I can't uh, I can't make that jump. Not it's gonna be full of bees. Got him. Okay. Why y'all always do that? Huh? Why y'all think that's okay? Hmm. I feel like I'm going to be coming up on another save point. Somewhere in the near future. That jump was awful for me because I forgot about the midair dash. I think it's also the fact that when the midair dash comes through, it's um, it's not so easily remembered that um, you can do like when you dash on the floor, it overrules everything, so you're not accustomed to having the dash afterwards. It's very, very bizarre. Like, on occasion, I forget about it, too. But that one, I just... You see, I just took a moment to stop and think. Hang on. Okay. Y'all already know how I feel about boxes. That chest exists as a lure, nothing more. Yeah, exactly. It's just a way to waste your fucking time and energy. That's real big 2020 energy right there. Oh damn, girl, you got bodied, huh? What's good? 
In me. Please. End my... S oh, God. I hate when they do this. Hang on. I gotta get some goat cheese first. I, I hate when games make me decide if people have to die. Hold on, y'all. Time out. Stop. I, I hate this shit. Dumpster Fire official sponsor of 2020. Right? Ooh. Hang on. I need to take another bite of that goat cheese. Nail painting is hard. Eh, it depends on a lot of stuff. Your dominant hand, you can always have on point. I'm sorry. Your non-dominant hand is always on point. It's your dominant hand that looks a mess. Like, even in my case, when I file my nails, this is my left hand, and like everything's nice and even. I don't have any issues. And then you get to my right hand, and I can't file that shit. I'm terrible at it. Hope you're having a lovely day. Hey, Blizzbear, welcome on in. We're having a great day. Barring the fact that OBS is a piece of garbage. I'm going to take another bite of goat cheese and we're going to decide on this woman's fate. I don't want to kill her. I literally don't want to kill her. I hate this shit. Mmm. I could try. That would be a mess. My boyfriend bites his nails. I just want to know who's going to teach the first PhD level course on the history and political ramifications of the year 2020 in USA. Yes, goat cheese. Oh, God. It's really good. Matter of fact, I'm going to dump my calzone in it. Mm-hmm. That's the power play. I think she died anyway. Yeah, she died anyway. Passiflora. What is a Passiflora? Fully restores HP. Well, that's useful. You're hired. Ooh. I think this is the end, officially. Where are your cute cats? Oh. They're right here. Oh, you mean my cute cats? Uh, they're up front because they hate me. They're up front because they hate me. Oh, we're not at the end yet. Oh, you sleeping, dude. Bye. How she got a flower that fixes your HP and go off and die? To be fair, she wasn't trying to actually rock with me at the beginning anyway, if you remember. Oh, well, that was just not useful now, was it? Who are you slashing at? There we go. Whomst are you? Okay. Okay. Well, that's no good. Oh, we're gonna do this shit. So far, we've guessed three times in a row. Oh, we're doing good. We're doing great. All right, where you at? I want this one. Yeah. I'm just gonna do all the low ones. Yeah, you're lower, fuck you.
Yeah! I think that actually might be the strat. <laughs> I could be way wrong. I don't think I'm wrong, though. I'm actually pretty sure this is the strat on accident. <laughs> oh, oh. Ah, oh, fuckles. Yeah. That's 100% the strat. So I always get the one that's lowest. You're lower than everybody, fuck you. <laughs> oh, oh man, that's funny. Also, the one that she shoots is blue. Everyone else's is white. I'm noticing that. Hers has blue in it. Oh, I can hit that multiple times, I bet. Oh, I've been over here lollygagging and BSing everybody. Yeah, I can hit her three times. Damn, I feel like this is going to take forever. Were we just playing with food there? Like, I don't understand. I think we were just playing with food. There's no way in the world that was the final boss. All right, let me see what I've missed. The real boss fight is a test of your patience. Lurk while I prep Boba? Are you sharing, though? Um, let's see. Anglerfish that has a treasure chest instead of a light. Oh my god, I know this reference. I know this reference. Oh no, because I've seen this fish. It's Shovel Knight. Shovel Knight. Where you're like bouncing off of it and it's like, why is your... Yeah? Yeah? <clears throat> um, let's see. Roland fucked me up, but as a Mordecai player in the first one, Bloodwing hit me a little bit harder. Ooh... Ooh. Um, let's see. Do do do. Okay, good. I'm caught up. This goat cheese is so good. I'm so happy I ordered this. Ooh, one of my mushrooms got away. Gotta fix that. You silly panda bear. You can't get away from me. You're a mushroom. Mm. Yeah, the Mordecai kill or the Mordecai Bloodwing kill was brutal. BL2 isn't a very emotional game despite their attempts, but Bloodwing, first time I ever vowed revenge on a functional character. Right, there was no reason to do what they did to Bloodwing. Hey Mojo, but what if I told you those are spoilers? All right, the Roland one I, I'm a little bit more forgiving of. But the one in three, yeah, I'm pretty sure everyone doesn't know that. Just a friendly FYI. Why the fuck am I going back this way? Oh, this is why I'm going back this way. Never mind. I wasn't being goofy. I was being smart. I was being smart. Hey, Yeti. How are you? How have you been? Um, hmm, there's something in this area that leads down. And it's in this particular room. Hmm. Where are you? Got it. I was like, it's in here. I could see the thing pointing down. Oh, it's a vitality shard. I'm good, enjoying a chill day today. How are you? I'm great. Lucid Ice Seraph, how are you? Welcome on in as well. Wow, rude. Hope you're having a great day. Damn, there's more vitality fragments? How much health can this girl have? 
No, I just damage boosted that. That works. Yes, prepping boba. Our closest place is 20 minutes away, and the last time I stopped in, no one was wearing a mask, so I'm learning to make my own. Uh, that's valid, though. I respect it. I understand your pain. I had boba yesterday. I feel bad. I feel bad. Good morning. I'm doing well today. Hello. Welcome on in. The Bloodwing thing was purely a means of reinforcing the notion that Jack was a bastard. It worked, though. You had the Bloodwing moment? All right. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and put it out there. There's spoilers for Borderlands 2 and 3 coming in. If you don't want those, mute for maybe the next two or three minutes. I'm going to give it a count of ten. So, in Borderlands 2, I disliked Jack, but he was still entertaining. And then Bloodwing happened, and I was like, nah, I gotta fuck you up. I literally have to punch you in your fucking groin. And then, and then you find out who the actual, um, Oracle person is, and you're like, you're probably one of the worst people I've ever met. I, I, I now know that I am absolutely required to end your existence in every iteration possible. Because that man did that to his own kid. I I could not... Woo! Oh, I didn't get it fast enough. Bye. Okay. I keep meaning to buy some milk tea powder. I don't need the boba itself. Jack deserved... Yeah, Jack absolutely deserves the L. 150 fucking percent. And anyone wants to be like, well, I can understand where he's coming from. Are you sure? Are you sure? I enjoyed what the uh, twins did in three, specifically because I'm a streamer. Because every single person I know who doesn't like the twins is someone who tried to create a Twitch channel that did not get any grounding. And I was like, feeling called out? Feeling You feeling attacked? Feeling attacked? I feel like you're feeling attacked. Did do you not like the twins? Cause this is the energy you try to come in on and you didn't and it didn't work? I I, I feel like you're just being you're being attacked. Oh yeah. That's what made the TPS so hard to play. You already know that Jack's a piece of shit and they try to make him seem sympathetic. You gotta go check out the twins. Oh, they're super annoying. They're super frustrating. There's some moments that they have that are very valid and they're very, very, oh yeah, this would totally happen. But for the most part, they're just jackass streamers that say a bunch of buzzwords and like hot phrases and other shit. And they're the most popular channel on the planet. And I was like, I feel like you don't like them because they're accurate. Sorry. I, I literally feel like you don't like them because they're accurate. I like the twins because they were a different brand of asshole compared to Jack. I appreciate seeing the journey of Jack the handsome Jack, but also fuck you. Right. Exactly that. The the journey to get there, A plus. Nine hundred times over would do it again and again and again. And every single time I'd be like, man, that was written so well. I really hope you eat a bag of fucking nails. Really hope you eat a bag of nails. Okay, why is this here? This is just a distraction? Hmm. Interesting. Let's get another one. Oh, I hate when this game does this shit. I hate it. Oh, and you're gonna keep doing- Oh my god. Everything is terrible. No, it's a little bit easier this way. Because they can't keep up. Alright, let me look at this. As someone who went to school for marketing, the use of the twins' buzzwords made me want to cap them faster. That's what I'm saying. As someone who had to build her channel from the ground up, like, just straight the fuck up, and have people be like, oh no, you don't deserve that because you're just a novelty and other shit, I'm like, nah, you, you thought that this is what you were supposed to be, and then you were disappointed when that wasn't the case. That room sucked. Well, that was bad. Uh, I let me see here. I mean, all in all, I didn't hate the twins. I just hate the who you know they. <clears throat> in the third one, I don't know what that means, Phoenix. 
Uh, I just wish the final battle was better. Yeah, the final battle was pretty fucking boring. I'm not gonna front. Though, in the defense of Borderlands 3's final battle, Borderlands 2 also suffers from the exact same problem. Like, that final battle is not great by any stretch. Whatsoever. Tom, you absolute bastard. Let Isabel out to trick-or-treat tonight. Don't play with my heart like this. No! No! Be nice to Isabel, even though she made me mad with my island ratings. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They off a couple people, though. And it's just kind of irritating. Like, I feel like I appreciate the twins' placement, but some of the actions in the gen in the grand scheme of things just... Why? Why was that necessary? I wish Jack was portrayed as more sympathetic in Borderlands 2, though. The protagonists really are bad people fighting for a cruel world. Jack had a point, and I wanted to believe him for a minute. Mm, I don't know, because he had a point, but then it's how he chose to pursue that point that really put him in the gutter for me. Like... There was a point to be made, but saying that you made a point doesn't give you license to be a fuckface asshole. It doesn't give you license for that. So, regardless of what that point is, the manner in which he did it and tormented his own kid to get there, nah, I, the point lost all value to me. You're a fucking prick. You're a prick. And being like, but I just wanted a better world. You literally sucked the soul of your daughter dry for that world. Evaluate your fucking motivations, dude. Mouthpiece was fun. Mmm. I did like that the bosses had, like, different little quirks and fun things with their fights. Mm-hmm. Exactly that, Mojo. Jack and the twins have that exact same problem, where it's like, so because you had to experience one singular bad thing that many people also commonly experience, you feel like that gives you license to be a fucking dick? Really? That's the play? That's what we're leaning into. Okay. Here's that L you were ordering. Now I wonder if I'm on the final boss. The electric floor boss, I think, was in that one arena. It was a guy who was just, like, a womanizing chauvinistic asshole that used to date Moxie. Oh, this is totally it. And then I rolled into one because, of course, I did. back for a second. Whoop. Oh, so that place was not great. Shit. There we go. I have a neck itch. Sorry, I'm focusing this real fast. Ah, I got caught. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yep, I got caught. I got greedy. I admit. Okay. I feel like... I was gonna say, I feel like there's no way in the world that that's done. Oh, don't like none of this. Oh, I definitely don't like that. Oh, come on, lady. Um, but I hope everyone has a great day. Thank you so much for hanging out, Nintendo nerds. I appreciate you. I'm so sorry I can't read chat right now. I'm pretty sure this is the final boss fight. So I'm trying to make sure we can get this out. That's chunky. Oh, that's fair. Yeah, that's real chunky. I like that. I gotta redo my charge now, though. Oh, no. Damn it. What? Why am I poisoned? I need those to move. Do 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 do. Waiting for the spinny stuff to move. Oh, that's so close, though. Hoot. I was like, there we go. Oh, God. And I died. Really, is it going to be a case where we both have to die? Kaho, the high priestess from the village of Loon, failed in her mission of sealing away the curse. The world of the living was further infested by spirits of the dead, who continued to spread misery throughout the world. Bad ending! <laughs> I like how it's clear and concise. What ending did I get? Bad ending. That's the one you got. You got the bad ending. All right, so. <laughs> By the time I finished, I had about 8.5 hours and 90% of the game. Yeah, I was like, yeah, that final boss isn't bad at all. That isn't bad at all. And we are right outside her doorstep, I think. Yep, there she is. So, let's do some file cleanup, yeah? Now we're going to do our original plan. So we've beaten the game. Now the next thing is going to be... We're going to take this off. Oh no, we're going to take this off. I want this. I mean, that description certainly sounds like the bad ending. Yeah. Do, 
Do 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 do. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep spot checking things. We already went to that side. You already went to that side. That girl that's in the bottom there, she doesn't want to talk to me, and I don't know why. There's also a couple of things I still have to buy. Um, hmm. I gotta head out for a bit. Halloween plans with my sister starting soon. Oh, that was boo-boo. We did this. Um, y'all have a good one and happy Halloween. Thank you so much for hanging out, Mojo. I appreciate you. I think I want to go this way. Wait a minute. There's a secret in here. It's up there. It has to be. It's up there. There has to be something up there. Because apparently I just had it go off. There we go. There's a secret. So when it gives you a secret, it gives you a little quick noise when you enter the room and my controller vibrates. I was like, something just went wrong. Something is amiss. Okay, so there's nothing of value in here. Unless... Okay, we need to go down, and then there's a room I haven't touched. Wait a minute, did I get it again? Yes! Turned the vibration off when I played and didn't hear the noise. Yep, I have a vibration and a noise. There we go. So there's another fragment. More fucking health. Oh my lord. Ooh, we're at 95%. We've almost got most of the map thrown uh throw away. I was about to read your name. Revealed. There's nothing of value in here. Enemy pouts. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Oh, that's just a walk around. That's all that is. Hmm. I refuse to die as a cat, though. Like, I'm not doing the shit. Oh, God. No vibrations. Still no vibrations. Mm -hmm. Oh, but there's something down there. So let's go this way. And we just had a vibration. But the vibration's in here? There's a secret in here. It's in this area. 
Oh, it's just this area right here. I didn't go this way. I heard the noise. Yeah, did you hear it? I finally died to spikes. If that ain't some shit. Damn it. My streak. Alright. I wanna know where the secret is in here. So if you wanna hear the saddest noise dropping the spikes as a cat? No, fuck that. I refuse. Wait a tick. But that's blocked off now. Curious. Bat, no, ah, the old platform classic denies, yeah. There we go. Problem solving. <sighs> Get cheesed on. I play platformers. Get cheesed on. Get cheesed. Whew, all this for a vitality fragment, huh? Okay, so that covers that area. Oh my gosh. Bobo acquired delicious, but you have to tell us how it turned out and then you're gonna be responsible for sending some to everyone in the wine cellar Mm-hmm I beat the final boss and so now we're cleaning up the file, but we got the bad ending We got the bad ending No vibrations uninterested Oh my god, this is gonna make me absolutely bonkers. Where is it? Hmm. There's something in here. My usual strats of. There we go. Got it. That's what's in here. And then just to verify. Yep, we're good. You really put on the do you have enough for the rest of the class card? Yeah, I am. Because I'm in I'm interested in Boba, okay? I like Boba. And so if it's good, I would like to see it. See? Okay. So far we are we have no vibe checks. Still no vibe check. Still no vibe check. Do I need to buy things from you? No. This version of you is good. Girl, shut up. I'm gonna have to re-explore everything, so I guess it doesn't matter if we go up or down first. Which engine should you do in Time Spinner? Hmm. I personally do the one where you go all the way back in time. The first one, the one I did on stream was going all the way back in time. And then, um, off stream, I did the other endings. 
because I'm very much, I was very much in the camp of, I want to get rid of all this shit before it even can start. So that, like, down the line things could change. I'm a fan of having something to chew while I'm drinking. Boba gets A plus from me. I feel like something to chew while I'm drinking, it has to be something specific too. Like it can't be something that requires a lot of extra energy and force. If it's something that's meant to be chewed by itself, then I can't do it. But like what I'm doing right now with the tea and like the kind of soft bread with goat cheese. Oh yeah, this shit's A plus. I, many good calls were made today. And Arkrad, I'm pretty sure you're not the only one with that issue. Ah, I pulled it off. Let's go up, because there's rooms I haven't done in up yet. Really, girl? You fell? But yeah, Time Spinner is a very, very good game, and I will always, always, always recommend it every time people come through about it. Actually, I don't want to go up, because that's the castle towards the end. Yeah, that's the final boss right there. Hmm. You hate to see that. So let's change our plans. Let's go to the right, and then loop down and around. Bad dog, bad. Oh, that dog's worse. You see how he tried to bamboozle me? Damn, no vibe checks though. Still no vibe check. Oh my God, I've explored too well. Every time I don't get a vibe check, part of my soul dies. Especially since I have four rooms left that I need to explore. I know one is going to be in the northern area. These are all going to be secret passages, I think. There is another one. So, one... Three, because technically the boss room counts as one. I knew that much. I know that much. Oh, I still need to play Dandara. Oh my god. I've heard so many good things. Seven, eight. It might be a double room, though. Hmm. Let's keep moving. Let's go to the right, like I said. The vibe checks. Where are they? Let's see. I was loving Dendara, but stopped because there's an update to the game that wiped my save file that night. I just couldn't. Are you kidding me? Did you tell the devs? Did you tell the devs? Oh, jeez. And was it not on the cloud? Have the kitties ever tried to sleep on your keyboard? Yes. If I leave on a BRB and I'm gone for more than like three or four minutes, when I come back, sometimes Funky will decide he wants to upgrade his life and go from the chair to the keyboard. And then sometimes he upgrades further and goes from the keyboard to my actual desk. Little jerks. I got bloodstain. Ritual of the night. And time spent on my Metro Avenia's to finish list. Yeah. This one has been on my list for a hot minute, so I'm super happy that we're going through it now. I've been wanting to go through this for a while. Sadly, no, it came at the end of a day of mental notes. So when it happened, I was just like, well, fuck this day. You know what? That's valid, though. Sometimes you just be like, you know what? I, I can't. Ah, I'm still missing something for that. 
I need a vibe check, though. This is starting to make me sad. Oh, get out of here. Nothing is vibrating. I've done too well. No. Why? Why are there no vibrations to be had? Also, I still don't know what Cursed does. I just know I've had it and I've always had it right by a save point. I don't know about a vibe check, but I can give you a hug. Oh, well, thank you. I be needing the vibes. Because it'll let me know when I've missed secrets. Oh, I haven't talked to you in a bit. When our highest made a contract, the underworld certainly she did not expect this outcome. Or did she? Hope for the success of your endeavors, maiden from Lou. Face the loyalty that remains, if it has not turned to fear yet. Yep, yeah, it's gonna be the same. It was still never explained why her eye went red randomly. Gotta check up here. Oh my god. Every time it doesn't vibe, I get sad. Hmm? What? I still have a door that's not done. Huh. Did she get new cats? I don't think she did, sadly. time for you mm. starts checking his vibes I'm saying I'm only saying that because and this is our fault, fall FYI it's only because of the fact that Every time I'm by a secret, my controller will actually vibrate and make a noise in the game. And so, my controller has gone an extensive period of time without vibe checking me. And I'm getting sad now. Actual anxiety is being experienced. I don't know what the curse does. I'm cursed again. I still don't know what the curse does. Maybe it's like a one-hit kill or some shit. It puts an X over your items. Oh! That's not the bad, worst thing. Hmm. Hey, Arch. How are ya? I'm still no vibes. Need vibes. I'm really surprised that there's not one in here. Like, this is a perfect placement for it. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, yeah, there's a dog there. No. Oh, 
Oh, girl, you turned around to see yourself die. I'm good. Just woke up an hour ago, though. I woke up 10 minutes before stream if it makes you feel better. God damn it. This sucks because I still have to find ivory bugs. That was my fault. I wasn't paying attention. Whoops. But on the plus side of things, we know that there's not shit up there. So, so, counterpoint, that's just being efficient. Because now I'm back down here. Chad is taking this exact moment to be like, Auntie, do self care. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I, um, part of the reason I didn't wake up until like 30 minutes before is because I just stayed in bed. The ring of candor you bought helps for ivory bugs. That's what I'm wearing. That's exactly what I'm wearing. That's why we're running around. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're already on top of that. Vibe checked! Aha! There's something in here. Girl, I don't care about you. Got it. Okay. Okay. Let's counter check. Vibes are gone. Okay, that's what we needed in there. I got very excited because my, my controller vibrated and made me happy. Hmm. Actually, let's go, let's go around here real fast. Is there any rooms I need to reveal here? No. Oh, ring candor makes the controller vibrate? Yep! It'll make the controller vibrate and play a sound in the room. If you're using keyboard, it just makes a sound. Yep, it makes the controller vibrate as well. So that's why I've been lovingly calling it the vibe check. Oh, no vibe check. Still no vibe checks. Did I get everything off of you? Yes, I did. Also, fun facts about the Ring of Candor. That's the only item in the game that you will ever find at the vendor multiple places for lower prices. So if you would have bought it right away, it's 400 on purpose. And then it goes down to 350 and then someone reported that it gets down as low as 250 if you haven't bought it yet. Damn, he's just gonna take arrows to the face. Hate to see that. Ah, uh, this room is a dud. This is a dud. Dud. Hmm. Let's go down and left. Another dud. Okay. Down and right. I want to check these rooms though. Because we're basically just rerunning the entire map. Gotcha, bitch. And this is where the boss fight was. No vibes. Still no vibes. I will say doing that on controller is way more difficult than it looks. Because I can't quite get my thumbs to line up correctly on B and A at the same time. I have to switch over to this way to do it. 
What was that loud buzz? What loud buzz? Hey, culinary. Okay, so roll jumping isn't a thing per se because you can't actually roll and jump. So I was watching Half Coordinated do the speed run last night and it's a frame perfect jump is what it is. And that's how he does his speed run to get through the game in like 40 minutes or less. I mean, my phone isn't in here doing stuff. So I think it's on other folks side because it definitely... Okay, I have my phone, but I'm not using it and I'm not in Discord. And I don't have any notifications. So I don't think it was me. Maybe it's more stuff with OBS and Twitch. Yeah, I was going to say, that sounds like it's something that would be an OBS thing. There you go, friend. Oh, my gosh. That says 35 fucking months. Jeez Louise. Vivi, thank you so much for the 35-month resub. I appreciate you so much. Can we please get some hype in chat for the 35 months? This man is trying so hard to hit me. Mmm. I need to give you your tracking number. I sent your mug. I sent your mug. Uh, so... Are you serious? I've been streaming for three years. Yeah. That's a lot. <laughs> Vivi, why you gotta put me on blast like that? And hey, Sammy B. That's not the same Sammy B I think it is, is it? <gasps> Vibe check? Is there secrets? Where are they? It's within this screen. It's in this room. What in this room can be done? There we go. This is my second time here, so I don't think I'm the one you're thinking of. I was gonna say, I was like, huh? Um, the fact that I've known you for more than three years though, what is that? I know! I, it's so wild to me, like the ongoing like startup and everything of the wine cellar. Hmm. But right now we're puzzling. We're doing file cleanup. So for those of you who are just joining, we've actually beaten the game. We've actually beaten the game. And now we're just trying to clean up and get all the ivory bugs and shit. I may open the door to some backseating, but I'm just fearful of that because I've already had some people come in and immediately start backseating when per usual, I have not asked for help in any magnitude. Oh, don't fall into spikes, dear God. Oh, nice, you already beat it. Yeah, I already beat it. That's what my plan was out the gate. I wanted to beat the game. So I went in and I beat the boss. The final boss I don't think is bad at all. I think there are bosses that were before it that were way more difficult. Hmm. I think it's like up in this wall, if I'm being honest.
Also, why aren't these dropping now? Uh, hello? Riot just announced a new project for earlier next year called Fallen King, A League of Legends Story, and the roster of heroes looks unexpected. Final boss is pretty easy. Yeah, I thought it was pretty easy. Lupierre and Magnolia are the worst, in my opinion. Yeah, I don't even remember those names. I'm not even gonna front. Hmm, I might look this one up. I might look this one up. I have a sneaking suspicion it might also be something to do with down here. Like, in a small area. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. It's either gonna be... It's either gonna be something that's in, like, this middle area, or it's gonna be that wall up there. I'm almost certain of it. Almost fucking certain of it. How far is the save point? It's not far. Oh, Lupier and Magnolia. See, I didn't even think those were that bad, because I've noticed with this game, everyone has a very distinct attack pattern. Hmm. And... I realized, as of yesterday, I didn't even die because Magnolia has a dagger. I died to my own fucking poison. Hmm. I think I am gonna look this one up. Because I don't want to leave this room without getting my cookies. Because I'm pretty sure it's a bug. Oh my god, the peanut butter. I love that it's peanut butter and wine. Like, that is the most unheard of combination, and now I'm, like, obligated to try it. Mixasplast, thank you so much for the three months. I appreciate you so, so very much. Oh. We're in the process of playing Momodora Reverie Under the Moonlight. And we're trying to 100% our file. And Culinary, thank you so much for the hype and chat. There's a secret in this room, and I'm trying to figure out how to get it. I might go ahead and eat a dirt sandwich. I knew spikes were going to be an insta-kill. That's why I was avoiding them all game. I felt it in my bones it would be an insta-kill. Oh, I didn't hit the one. That sucks. That's fine. That was a save from hell. I was not supposed to survive that. Hmm... Although I'm wondering how people probably looked up and set out how the bugs are set, because um, if they don't have pictures and shit, I feel like this is going to be a really hard push. Oh, damn it, I do this every time. I also feel increasingly bad every time I kill them from behind. I thought I hit this one. Peanut butter and wine, it's so good. I mean, I feel like that's just opening the, the floors and floodgates for someone to be like, oh, you want peanut butter wine? At which point I'd have some feelings. Hmm? Oh, Frosty, thank you so much for the four months. I appreciate you. Can we please get some more hype in chat for the four month free sub? Where in the fuck could these be? God damn it. It's not there. I was gonna say, I figured those would still hurt. Those still hurt too. Hmm. PB and liquid jelly. You're not wrong. You're not wrong at all. Alright. 
Who wants to be, who wants to do me a solid and actually look up what the secret is in this room? I, I've already kind of exhausted my one idea. I was like, watch me find it now that I'm asking. Hmm. It has to be this wall that's up here. There's nothing for me to go down into. Hmm. Unless... Okay, you just looked it up. What you got? What's the game called? This is Momodoma Reverie uh, Under the Moonlight. It's on the right end of the room. Okay, I started getting some vibes from that. Oh my gosh, there it is. The question is, how do I get up in there? Mint has so many great uses. I throw my, I grow my own mint in my backyard and I'm about to start bottling my ginger mint tea I make, but you, you ain't shared none of this tea with me and I'm upset now. There we go. I was gonna say, if it wasn't gonna be up here, I start moving this way and it's like, ooh, this has a decent amount of real estate. Oh, thank fuck. All right, so we know all the way to the right doesn't, all the way to the right, all the way to the left doesn't do anything. Thank you so much. Um, Let's go up and left again and hope for more vibe checks. I would love to have something or a setup to where I could start growing my own stuff, period. I would love to have fresh mint so I can make mojitos. I really enjoy mojitos when it's a hot day. Oh my gosh. No vibe checks in here. Let's go this way to be safe. Would be happy to send to you. Oh my god. Would the mint even make it through the, the actual travel though? That's something I'm concerned about. Like, I've sent baked goods in the past. I did all that. I've sent baked goods in the past, and they've made it, but I've had to send them priority just because I wanted to make sure they did make it. And then with how everything's been going down with COVID, I'm super afraid because the last thing I want is for someone to redeem treats in the wine cellar. And all of a sudden, they're telling me about how they got their stuff. And it was a moldy disaster. That was weird. Because if someone gets their treats and it's mold, I would be so shitty. Okay, so let's get this. Treats? Yeah. Echo, quit acting brand new. You know I send baked goods. Oh, for fuck's sake. Come on. That's fine. Oh, I know, I just mean I'm waiting. Yeah, did you not hear me when I announced the baking stream yesterday? I announced when I'm doing it. I even announced what I'm making. Oh no, it's sap, boys. Okay, so we're good here. I don't think I was here for that. Is there a command to check your quirks? Uh, exclamation point quirks, Javon. You wanna do exclamation point quirks. Sending plants in the mail is 50-50. I've ordered some and had everything be fine. Sometimes plant just dies from the stress. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Yeah, so you could do quirks. I might have cookies on cooldown because I have a full queue right now. If I don't have cookies on cooldown and you redeem it, I'm probably not going to be doing that run of baked goods until late December, early January because I still want to do my fall push. Okay, nothing in here. Hmm. Every time I'm entering a room and it's no vibe check, I like want to cry. Want to cry. Yeah, so you got cat treats, wine facts, sit-ups, push-ups, a game key giveaway, and then pop him. Get out of here. Get out of here. You gotta do redeem and then pop in. Make it right! 
There you go. Thank you so much, Echo, for doing popping. So everybody in the channel just got 400 quarts on behalf of Echo. So everyone will say thank you to Echo for the popping command. You're 400 quarts closer to either a free game key or some cookies. Would you consider growing your own mint? Oh, I absolutely would. Just where I live right now and our living setup, there's no way in the world I'd be able to maintain it. Just because we live in BFE, Indiana, where everything is dry as fucking just coal. And then, um, on top of all of that, God damn it. Everything's just super dry. And then on top of all of that, I would love to do it at a place that I owned and not rent. Because right now we're renting. Oh, late night. Did you redeem a game? Yeah, you did. It didn't give me my sound. So here, for those of you who don't know how this works, whenever someone does a giveaway redeem, I will pull up my mighty list of games and I'll do a giveaway. And then if you've been in my charity streams, you know how this works. If you win, I'll get you at the end of stream and I will say, hey, pick from this list of games and then you can just pick one. And people who've won these giveaways will tell you, my listing is uh, it's pretty dope. Ah, uh, to own somewhere? Yeah. If I'm going to grow stuff, I want to own the place that I'm growing at. The games are solid. So yeah, let's get that going. Mm-hmm. Yes, clear the shit. Get out of here. We're trying to have cozy gaming. I was like, listing's not a game. So with that being said, type giveaway in chat for a chance to win a game key. I have a little bit of every genre. I've given away things like Dendara, which was mentioned earlier. I've given away copies of Borderlands. I've given away copies of Hollow Knight, all types of stuff. So yeah, I just opened it up and you can type giveaway in chat for a chance to pull a key. I don't have time, Echo. I literally don't have time. Like, for all the stuff that I do just in general, there's no way in the world I'd be able to maintain medium and do reviews and do curation and handle, like, panels and hosting and all of that stuff all at the same time. Hmm. I didn't get a chance to say hi to you, Click Weeder. Or, uh, if I redeem, can I enter? Yes! Absolutely! You're not gonna redeem and then be like, okay, I can't enter, though. That's just goofy. Yes! Other streamers are allowed to- Where are y'all coming up with these arbitrary rules? Yes, you can enter. What do you mean? <laughs> what, are y'all in communities where people will say you can't enter if you're a streamer? Has someone done this? Can I beat them up? Like, what? Oh my gosh. That was a boss fight. I'm a giver, so I normally participate. No, that's fine. That query at least made some sense to me, because it's like, okay, I get where you're coming from, because I'm the same way. I'll just pop it open and be like, okay, I'm not going to enter. And people are like, wait, you just spent it? You're not going to enter? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's fine. I have a backlog from hell. Wait. Vibe checked. Okay. Eh? We got vibes. Gotcha. Okay. That was kind of you to ask. Yeah, I just wasn't sure if it was rude or something. No. The giveaway is open to everyone who is in the channel and active at the current time. I've had plenty of people who've come out of lurk to enter the giveaway and then will say something to claim things and then go right back to lurking. The only time I put stipulations up is when it's things like I'm giving away a Yeti microphone. When I give away to Yetis, I am restricting that to at least regulars. Like you gotta be a regular in order to enter those baseline. I have no, I don't have the heart. <clears throat> hey, Nasimbi. 
I don't have the heart to do something that's like sub only. That and then like, I feel like, I don't know. I'm weird about sub only stuff in general. Ah! All right, I'll go ahead and pull here in just a moment. Let me go ahead and save. Um, yeah, save in a straight line here. There we go. All right, I gotta put my leg down. I didn't realize I've been sitting with my leg up this entire time. It just felt natural. So, oh, we have a good number of people. So with that being said, the winner of today's game key is Javon, where are you? Where are you? Javon. Oh, I need a microphone, future goal. Yeah, game, uh, gamer. So I am sponsored. Fantastic. Javon, you're today's winner. So at the end of stream, I will go ahead and hit you up with a key. Um, Because of how Momodora is set up, it's a little bit of a pain in the ass. So can you just go ahead and drop me a line on Discord since I know you're in the community and say, hey, I won today's giveaway. And then I'll get it to you as soon as I'm done with stream today. And that's how giveaways work. So you don't have to wait for me to raise money for charity. You could just redeem some corks and be like, nah, she's going to give away keys now. And then <laughs> Echo's just like, whoop, it goes back to <laughs> lurking, like I'd said before. There was a giveaway, congrats, yes. Um, in terms of what Gamer uh, Keb was talking about, I'm sponsored by Blue Microphones. I'm part of the Blue Mic crew. And so I can give away a microphone every so often. There we go. And usually I'll do it with like big uh, events and stuff that I'm doing. Or if I don't have an event coming up, I'll probably just do a game day where I'll play something. Thank you so much, Javon. I'll play something that's going to be a lot more lightweight and kind of manageable. And then I will give away a microphone. And Calroon, thank you so much for dropping off that link. Hey, Ted, how are you? Ooh, I can see the layers of pepperoni and it makes me happy. Have you been Ted? Haven't seen you in a bit. You're good. Good. I'm glad to hear. I hope things have been going well for you. I kind of want to get some of these other rooms. Hmm. Let's see. That's the castle. I think that's the castle, at least. I'm correct, that's the castle. So let's go straight to the right, yeah? And then once we get all of these actual rooms and stuff done, and I'm at 99%, his upswing can hit. Today I learned. Oh, that one I messed up. Oh no! Didn't mean to be a cute kitty. I wanted to heal. Now we're just gonna keep going right. Scat! Do, do, do. Oh, Cool Beans gonna check out their products and plus tea. Yes, uh, if you do exclamation point Dryad, you can look at the tea. And if you go through Dryad, you can use Twisted 10 at checkout and get 10% off your order. If you figure that out, let me know because I use the directions. <laughs> Just navigating the foolishness. Yeah, you're gonna have to give me like strats on that too. How many times can a giveaway be redeemed? I tried to do another one and nothing happened. I usually do one per stream, but if late night, if you just want to go ahead and like wipe out your stuff, I can fix that really fast. Give me one second. Come on. There's cookies. No, no. Gamer Keb, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Thanks for joining us. I'm glad you're enjoying your time here. Okay, so late night, if you want to do one, you can try it again. You can try it again. I just changed up the settings on it. So it should let you, it might not do it until next stream, unfortunately. I'm not 100% sure. So Metroidvania where you can go kitty, cool. Yeah, 
I've been having a really good time with it. I've got plenty of quartz, so no worries there. Okay, cool. I just wanted to make sure you were aware. This way you weren't, like, looking for it, and then all of a sudden it wasn't working. I would say, sir, I'm going to need you to not. There you Oh, wait. Oh, no, it's on cooldown. Wow, I had a lot of safeguards in place. All right. I'll go ahead and, um, I'll say go ahead and do it on Wednesday. And that's going to be what? Is it 31st? So, on the 4th. And then I'll have it changed up. How many quirks do you have late night? 11 D billion. Are you just the holder of all quirks? Why the hell did that do that? Oh, geez. Yeah, you have plenty of quirks. Okay. If I go on break, I'll go ahead and make some adjustments. Oh, wow. There's a lot more to this than I expected. Do, 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 Yeah. Yes! All vitality fragments. Let's go. I've ventured into the dangerous realm of custom boards and keycaps. Oh, shit. Ted, I'm so sorry, but also, whatever you pick, I require pictures. I, I almost got caught up in that. I almost did it, because there was one keycap that someone made that was like of this really pretty teal and purple lotus flower, teal, purple, and pink, and it was like all in one cap, and the cap itself was clear. I almost did it. I almost did it. And <laughs> exactly what Arkai said, good luck getting back. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, I ordered my board. I lived the lurking life pretty hard. Yeah, lurking is dope. Oh, he said good luck getting back on this. Um, whoop. Oh yeah, that's gonna be harsh. I think I'm gonna have to do a head bonk. I think I have to head bonk it. We're gonna find out. I'm pretty sure based on how it looks, it's a head bonker. Let's look. Uh, the roll ends beforehand. Oh, that's fine. Oh, how rude. Because, yeah, you got to make sure you have enough elevation to do it. Hmm. I got my achievement. I could be a little shit and just leave. But also... Max health, though. Oof. That boy, Angie. Alright. And I have to have this room and make it out anyway if I want to do 100%. Oh, that's not head bunker at all. I just have to keep that up there. That's easy mode. Doot. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Well, let me go ahead and do this. What is this? Oh, another bellflower. Nice. And that puts me at 98. Awesome. Still no sighting of ivory bugs, though. Hmm. I think I'm at 11 of 20 on that. Wow, rude. Sex bomb using head bonk instead. I just want to live like a magical girl. Oh my god. I think we all just want to live like magical girls. If we're being real about it. If we're being real about it. You want to type like a magical girl? I mean, like I said, I it almost got me. And I had to catch myself because I knew if I buy one, I would look at my keyboard and see the one and be like, I have to get matching ones. There's no way I can just let this be. What universe of magical girls, though? Because Madoka is live fast, die young, and that's uh, that's not everyone's goal. True. 
I, I think I'm gonna stick to the traditional route of uh, Sailor Moon Magical Girls. I'm very much Sailor Moon Magical Girls. Oh, hey, Anna. How are you? How are things? Alright, we're vibe checking still. Vibes? No vibes. And this is a boss room, I think. This I can get behind. Tokyo Mew Mew would also be fine. But yeah, Madoka's effing dark. Definitely Madoka for me. The banter was top tier and punny. Oh, gods. Uh-oh. Vibe check? Vibes have been checked. That was root what I just did. That's fine. Now that those are out the way, that was an easy one. Okay, so we're at 12. Oh God, I almost died. Uh, let's verify vibe checks. All right, this isn't gonna have multiples in here. Thank God for that. This man's just gonna come down here, huh? Oh, how rude. So that's a triple. So there's only eight more. I love Madoka. I got hit because I was reading chat. I love Madoka. I played the crap out of a mobile side story game. Uh, but wouldn't want to be a magical girl under those conditions. I feel like I've heard of Madoka, but I've never actually watched or heard Madoka. Woo! That man tried to knock me off my, my pedestal. How dare. We're gonna go up to the boss room one and then we're gonna bamf back somewhere else. I guess the universe post Godoka would be fine. Being absorbed into the law of cycles instead of alternative from pre wall wall purges. Hey Nix! Hey, how are you? How have you been? Congrats on affiliate, by the way. I never got a chance to say that to you. How are the things and stuff? By the way, I only use your wine glasses now. Just so you're aware. Uh hmm. That's the final boss. I feel like I need to get to that area. And then once we get the 99%, I'm going to go ahead and grab a guide for the rest of the bugs. Because then I know that that's how we get to extra things and stuff. Things are good. And yay, wine glasses. I love my wine glasses. I love them so much. I can't recommend Madoka Magica highly enough to people. It's so few episodes with such a wonderful story. I feel like I've heard of this. And I'm just not being smart right now. The fandom has kind of soured me on Madoka. Yo, I, I feel that energy though, because sometimes the, the fandoms can fuck up things real easy. Real fast. Real fast. Um, Let's just go ahead and do this. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. 
Oh, damn it. I was right. I should have went on instinct. God, I have so much money. Agreed on a recommendation. Such a nice take on it. The anime made me forever find cats to be sus. It's like, I no longer trust cats. I hope you're proud of yourself. So it's up there. You're not wrong there, Arch. That goes for so many fandoms, unfortunately. I say that all the time, and then I get, like, ragged on because people are like, oh, so you're going to let a few people sour your fun? It's not even just about the fact that it's a few people. It's about the fact that those few people will literally make you sound like you are the most inept, incompetent, and terrible person in the world if you... D God damn it. Get out of here. If you don't do... If you're not a part of, like, that fandom or you haven't tried it or you haven't seen it and shit. It's like, okay, fine. Well, I just won't do it now. Oh. That was very lucky. Pocket and sensory. Adds flame damage to your attacks. Ooh. I like that. A huge portion of the Madoka fan base would just shit on other magical girl shows, and I hate that. So many things leave room for people by toxic fans. Yeah. Yeah. Um, people who've played this. Do I have all items now? I think I have everything. If I have all items, I'm gonna take off the money stone. Actually, I might take it off anyway. Yeah. I'm thinking about buying the soundtrack, uh, Arcat. I really, really like it. I don't actually know. I never got them all. Well, we'll find out in a second. Oh god, that's already better. That reduces that hit count by two. What are you? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's... Dear god, better. You have an S-word, I think. Oh, that bird was still alive. I think there might be one or two more items to collect, but say there more might be spoilers to say nothing. Hmm. Ah, boo. Hmm. So I need to go left and down. I want to do that first. Get out of my face. Because I plan on getting all the achievements for this game. Oh! Whoa! Oh, we got a double vibe check. <laughs> I'm so mad he just gave it away. He just gave away what it was. Ooh. There we go. I was like, oh, I'll look for it. And he literally just casually walked into the room. All I can say is that the movies are not the anime. Rebellion is just meh. The fandom at large is problematic, especially in their blatant mischaracterization of a number of major players involved. Hey, game, you're not meant to spoiler either. Right. Spoilers from the game. Jerks. You're a jerk. Alright, so there's a vibe check in here. Hey, get off of there. No! Come back! I want to kill you! Gotcha, bitch. Alright, so... Now it becomes... Let's get some bonks there. That is certified bonked. I'm gonna start from the top and work my way down. Okay, that's bonked. Hmm. Hmm. Bonked. Hmm. 
Hmm. Where are your secrets? I twittered your oh my you I twittered you my board keycap selection PT. Oh god, you're gonna start something so bad. I think I have one item left from that merchant. Okay, let's do this. I'm gonna check these. I'm also curious if you end up watching Madoka, let me know what you think. I'm always game for magical girl shit. I mean, I'm playing a game about magical girls right now. Hmm. Power of kitty. Ah! My kitty fell. Oh no. That is not good kitty. There we go. I'm a great kitty. I'm an awesome cat. I am the best kitty. Quality. Okay, so now we need to go this way. No, I still need to go up because I need to go to the lower area. Is it just me or is Kitty faster? Kitty is faster. Kitty definitely closes that gap a lot better than um, Kaho herself does. Oh, sorry. Sorry, friend. Oh, this is easy. That wasn't okay. Oh, wow, this is awful. Ah, boo. Mm -hmm. What's my map at? We're still at 98. All of y'all can die. Get out of here. Still at 98. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. A black sachet. Hmm? Oh, I have a long list now. Heavily increases attack power at the risk of losing HP. Oh god. That just causes me stress. So now we need to go back around and up and we'll get a chance to save before we can do that. Fuck off. I think I said up this way. Yeah, I'm gonna go all the way up. Oh my god, having the fire, the fire leaf is real nice. Like, this is absurdly nice. Oh, come on now, ugly bird. Oh, wow, I thought that was dead. That was my fault. But it's okay. This is what I call dynamic art. Oh my god, I hate you so much. I hate you. I love that he just spoils it every time. Just casually walks in there like I gotta inspect all the rooms. That's what boss said Like don't inspect the secret room you fucking imbecile. What are you doing? This looks like Daria is Daria in this universe and I missed that If 
Bye, friend. I need that. Oh, I actually know exactly what the fuck that's for. God, I've been looking for that for ages. And I think we've covered all the map, with the exception of the boss room. Bye, friend. Oh yeah, I interrupt you now. Eat shit. Oh god, spikes. Hmm. What did you just pick up? I looked away. The sealed wind. Ooh, I had to save myself there. I picked up the sealed wind. God. I've wanted that for a while. Last thing I needed at least a thousand bucks for. Oh, we're right by a save room. And we're Gucci. Alright, so now the question is what is the easiest way to get to the sealed wind area? Hmm. I think that counted as a city? Yeah. I have to remember which square it's in though. Feels nice. I still want to know who the hell on my Steam list is listed as Sailor Moon. Wait, is it this way? Girl, shut up. Was that the triangle from Nuclear Throne on the painting? Mm hmm. I have no idea. is. Now that I have what I need, I of course have no idea where the fuck it is. Oh, I think it's this room. Nope, I'm still going the wrong way. Asshole! I'm trying to check my map. Okay. Oh. I'm sad because we're still not getting any vibe checks. Oh, this puppy is really determined. Determined to give me his money, I guess. No, because that's still inside. I know it's not this way because this is going to take me back to the forest. I wish there was a way I could like color code each area. Be 
you think the monastery bell might be closer? Mm. Get out of here. Oh, I think you might be right. I think he's outside the monastery. Because then I have to... I think I go this way? Yeah, yeah. And these chicks want me to keep paying them 15 bucks. I've already killed, like, your leads. Can you maybe a don't? Was it here? Yeah, here we go. Grabbing some free money. And now we want this. Uh, no. There we go. Bathe maple leaf in hibisco tea. Uh, oh, thank you so much, Shar. A uh, share. Yeah. Great gameplay. See you again soon. Thank you so much, Cher, for hanging out. I appreciate you. Have a good rest of your day. I'm still eating and stuff, but thanks for being here. Got fresh spring leaf. This blood leaf is able to purify the source of the curse. Wait, what? So then, wait. Girl, shut up. My leaf is green. So then, I was of the mind that the bunny was gonna give me something for that? And now I don't know what bunny is gonna give me. But now I've gone from swinging a red maple leaf to a green leaf. What does your shirt say or anyone in chat know? It says straight out of Nibbleheim. <laughs> straight out of Nibbleheim. As the uh, the original game that got me enamored with RPGs on a proper level. There you go. Straight out of fucking Nibbleheim. Get at me. <laughs> I believe because it's been dipped in hibisco, it's a tea leaf on brand. Yeah, it's it says dipped in hibisco tea. It's very on brand. I wonder if I could cosplay this. It looks like it's easy enough. Is it what? Just a black dress? Kind of like an attempt at a white mage hood? Never thought that attacking with a tea leaf was going to be that useful. I mean, it's extru it's excruciatingly on brand. Let's be real. Alright, so. Now. I have 14 bucks. I need six more. Now we are going to get a guide. We're going to legit get a guide. Mm hmm. Hmm. What do I want? Let's go to Steam, yeah? Okay. Wow, this is way out of date. 
According to DoorDash, I don't have my food yet. You know, my food that I've been eating this entire time? I don't have it yet. Maybe I should wait for another calzone. Hmm. I want steam. Yes. Oh my god, Nisimbi, I hate you. Hmm. There we go. I want something straight and to the point. I hate it when I'm looking at guides. As a fellow guide writer, few things aggravate me as much as I have that one. Having guides come through with a bunch of fluff. It's right there with fucking baking recipes. Where it's like, in order to get to the recipe, I have to read this whole fucking 20 year long diatribe about how their favorite dog ate their tuna sandwich and then it led to them getting divorced or some other bullshit. And I'm just like, I really just want the recipe. And I see that a lot with guides too, where it's like, this is a 100% bug guide. And then there's like a whole fucking 10 page thesis about how the creation of time and all this other shit. And I'm like, I, I just want to know where the fuck the bugs are. That's all I want. That's all I want. You're doing a whole lot of extra that I don't care about. Twitch Law says I have to share the second calzone. I'm pretty sure the boy will fight you on that. Okay. So we might be doing a little bit of back and forth, and that's okay. But I want all my bugs before I go beat the game a second time. Oh, wow. We have plenty of time on stream still. So let's do this. Oh, God. The three monitor setup come through. So now this is going to consist of a lot of spot checking, but all the elusive steps from the bugs sure are important for the plot. Oh my god, it just, it... <laughs> hmm. <laughs> That's all I could do is leave it at... Hmm. So da 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 da. One, two. You want this square. Got it. My eyes are on target. This is the only thing I hate about doing like fetch quest things in uh, games like this is that when I don't have ways for me to do things like put a pin on shit it makes it fucking impossible for me to keep track of where the hell I'm trying to go. Okay. There's a couple of other things I gotta do too. But yes, I am a very very big fan of Final Fantasy 7 even though most people will tell you that I will drag the game for filth. The original, at least. The Final Fantasy VII Remake was absolutely stellar. And I am super pumped for the second one that's coming out. Like, I cannot wait to see what they do with that. In any magnitude. So yeah, this one I knew I had. That would be number one. Um. Oh god, getting the last Geoculus on Genshin Impact was hell because it didn't pin the ones that already- Yep! Yep, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And like, in this, it's especially painful because I can't pin anything. And it's super frustrating because I want to know where the fuck I'm going in a lot of this. So I want to be able to just like throw some pins on- wait, wait, time out, vibe check? Okay, this is the first one I'm missing. Okay, so that covers that one. I thought I didn't have this one. I have that one. I have that one, I found it on accident yesterday, that was dope. So now let's go to Forlorn Monastery. Wait a tick. This is actually more efficient to go this way. Which, of course, I can't do. Yes, I can. Ah! I can cheese that, I think. Gotcha, bitch. 
I got the extra ones by complete accident after I already completed the statues. Oh gosh. Oh, speaking of Genshin, here we go. Is that still the plan when you 100% this? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. There will be Genshin Impact tonight, 100%. But like I said, I'm not high enough yet to uh, do group questing. So I can at you, but I can't do anything with people yet. Mm -hmm. Oh, boo. I messed up. Um, let's see. I still have one Geoculus and one Anemoculus. Anima Anima there we go. Missing, but there's one extra of each, so I guess I just don't care enough to torture myself again. Yeah, there gets to a fine point where it's like, if this isn't really gonna benefit me, it's like, then why the fuck am I doing it? Like, at least with achievements and shit, you can get me, like, hooked that way. But if you're not even gonna give me, like, a trophy for it, nah, fuck that noise. I ain't doing this shit. Alright, let's look here. So, straight line. And it's underneath that safe room. Um, I think I have this one, but I'm gonna just spot check anyway. Get that out of here. I don't know if you saw, but you sold this game to me. I did. I saw it on um, my Steam News and stuff. I absolutely saw it. Again, it's it's one of those things that it touches a it touches all the right spots for me because a it's pixel art. You're never gonna get me to say no to that. Um, B. Oh, you bitch. It's pixel art. You're never gonna get me to say no to pixel art. Um, it's a Metroidvania. You're not gonna get me to say no to a Metroidvania. Um, but then on top of that, it's short. Like, Bias, I've already beaten the game today. And now I'm 100%ing my map. Like, I'm just cleaning up at this point. And it still is, like, very pleasant, very enjoyable, very easy to navigate and go through. I'm having... Fuck off. I'm having no regrets owning this. As a matter of fact, I actually went and got the, um... Yeah, I thought I had this one. I went and got the uh, other, the other old Momodora that's on Steam. I got Momodora 3 just for shits and gigs. And it's like, oh yeah, how long the beat says you can beat this in like two hours. I'm like, ah, shit. If it really came down to it and I had time, I could 100% this boot up Momodora 3 and see if we can beat it. <laughs> All right, so let's warp again. Fuck you. Let's go in here. Um, bless this person for their mapping capabilities, because their maps are really fucking on point. I have that one. I have that one. I have that one. And they have pictures of the map and pictures of where the bug is. This is how we like guides. Momo 2 is also free and... and uh, and around an hour. Oh! Where's Momo 2 at? Because I didn't see it on Steam last night. I only saw Momo 3 in this one. Have that. Have that. Actually, I have all the ones that are here. So let's go to White Leaf. Let's go to White Leaf. Hmm. There's that part. I think I have that, but we're gonna spot check. I think I am still missing one thing from the vendor. Oh god, that takes two hits now. Amazing. Hmm? Oh, 
Um, very good to know. One and two are on itch.io at name your price. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, that makes sense then. Yep, I have the one in here. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna do this one. Y'all are watching me read a guide and then move on like straight up efficiency. Didn't realize how much money they just hand you in this. Wouldn't recommend one though because that one's ungodly hard. Well now I'm just interested. Because the hard games is my brand pretty much. And then being like, okay we did some hard stuff. Let's play some cozy RPGs. Let's play some cozy RPGs. Okay, I see where we are. So we're gonna go to both of those rooms? So yeah, I'm I'm super interested now. That had the opposite effect. I really wish there was something in here for getting this girl. Really, really do. Hi, Twisted. Happy Halloween. Hey, Monaco. How have you been? Haven't seen you in a bit either. Hope things are well. Uh-oh. Also, absolutely loving the hair up, dude. You look beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. I- Oh, hold up. Vibe checked. Alright, vibes have been checked. Vibes have been checked. Um, it's funny you said it because next week my hair is going to be straight again. <laughs> Usually these only last for like two weeks and then it becomes like, it goes from a twist out to an afro. Solid Mandragore, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on into the wine cellar. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Thanks for joining us. Hmm. Oh, I forgot to pose this to everyone. What are we playing after this? I was leaning into Iconoclast and now I'm not sure. Your hair is always on point. Oh, thank you, Mega. Alright, so we have vibes in here. We have vibes in here. Where are the vibes? What room am I in? Where are the vibes at? I would like to see them. Never heard about this game. Seems a bit like an old Metroid mixed with Castlevania and cuteness. Yes, that's been like the main descriptor for everyone. Boom, easy mode. Ooh. Oh no, they have that marked, right? Okay, so we got vibes here. Oh, we have vibes in here. Oh, oh my God, they're trying to kill me as a cat. This is exactly why I did that, because I had a feeling I was going to fuck that up. Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. Ah, oh, that's so far back. That's so cool. Talvo? I might have a suggestion. Twisted, there's a new Sekiro Super Bosses. I want to beat a game on stream, though. That's the thing. I want to do a game from start to finish. That's usually what I do. I don't want to just boot up that and then be playing it all over again. It would be cool, but I want to at least get a game on the docket and then I can go and if I have spare time, grab... Oh, I wasn't far at all. There's no reason for me to be griping. Uh, and then grab something like the Sekiro stuff. Well, they're unlocked via the boss rushes where there are Dark Souls 1 or 2. That's true.
There we go. Oh, crap. I have to be a kitty again. Huh? Ah! Stop trying to kill my cat! I don't like this. Our crap, they keep trying to get me to kill the cat. Dark Souls is pretty smooth to beat. Dark Souls 2 is an egg venture that takes a while. You could always do some one step from Eden for some cooldown. What's one step from Eden? Uh, that's the, uh, it's kind of like a Metroidvania card game-ish thing, right? I think I saw some people playing this. Or we could do casual month and do like, a bunch of cleanup in other games. We could go back to some dead cells. I haven't played that in for fucking ever. Let's go save. How many are we at now? 17? Okay. Shameful behavior trying to ruin your perfect run. Oh my god. I, I ruined my perfect run of no spikes. I can't ruin no death cats. Or no cat deaths. Hmm. Let's go to Subterranean. I love to watch you play some hard retros like DKC SNES playthrough. Oh, Donkey Kong? I love that shit. One step from Eden is the Mega Man Battle Network roguelike. Could go from cute to thirst and run Hades. That's what I was kind of saying with like Dead Cells and stuff too. I have to do both. Because I've been behind on both. Do you have stuff I need to buy? Boom. Necklace of Sacrifice. Increases your attack by 100% when in low health. Okay, I think I've bought everything from her now. Um, There was an area here that I couldn't get to because I needed to be a kitty. Okay. Down into the left? I think I have that one. sit down into the left when I'm going right. Oh, I need this one. Vibe checked. Um... Hmm. We got two more. There's also something else I want to address while I'm here. This is the part that puts me underwater a bunch, right? It's question mark. And there is an area that I couldn't get to because I was too too large. Thanks for enjoying ourselves. Our no trick or treat Halloween. Yeah, it sucks. Maybe I'll go out and get some candy. That's the last thing I need. Um, but I might still do it. I have that one. So now let's go back. Girl, you just keep getting bodied. I really like the aesthetic of the green leaf more and I don't know why. So now let's go to... There's one here. Hmm. Need to get to that save. And down and over. I'm just gonna double check it though to be safe. I think I have that. Seen this on Nintendo Switch Store and wanted to see it played. Oh, delightful. Um, I've actually beaten the game. I've been playing this. I started a fresh file yesterday. I'll give you some feedback on it so that you can at least have an idea. Um, I started this game brand new yesterday, straight out the box. And uh, I stream usually for five hours a stream. I'm all about some platforming. It's really solid platforming. It's moderately challenging, I would say. If you're used to playing difficult games and such, then it will be like a very, very nice even spot of a challenge. 
if you are not accustomed to playing a lot more of the difficult games, then it might be a little bit more challenging. And that might be your jam. I'm not 100% sure. But to give like some context of how long it's taken me to do some of this, I've been playing this since yesterday at 6.30 p.m. Uh, when I finished my stream last night at 11.40 p.m., I was sitting maybe 10 minutes outside the final boss. Uh, I beat the boss today when I started stream, and I've been doing file cleanup because I like to get all the achievements. And I am confident that I will be able to get most everything done before I end stream today. So yeah, this game, for a completionist standpoint, I think will take you probably a solid 8 to 10 hours, give or take. I think I did this one. I did not. <gasps> we only have one left. And right now, like I said, I'm working on 100% map completion. Um, there's a couple of things that if you stick around, James, it'll be very spoilerish. But if you don't care about spoilers, then by all means, hang around. Because I will be beating the game a second time today. And then um, I'm doing collectionist things as we speak. Okay, so I have one bug left, and I have four locations to peep out. I'm going to say it's this one. I think I know exactly where the last one is. To Karst Castle. Boom. All right, so where are we going? And I will tell you right now that I am using a guide so that I can get all the bugs and then finish out the rest of the game. Uh, where did I just spawn? Here? So I need to go to the left, up, and then to the right a little bit? Maybe I do have that one. I don't remember that. Hmm. We're gonna find out here in a second because I'll get a vibe check. Girl. Get out of here. Okay, so then we gotta go up. Nope, it's in here that I'm missing it. Listen, I'm not gonna have you kill me though. Fuck off. Yeah, I will play it. I've been trying to knock out Blasphemous, but need a break. Yo, Blasphemous is on my hot list, too. Uh, Blasphemous I need to do. I need to do... Um, there's something that's a same word, almost, but I can't think of it right now because, of course, I can't. Oh, that's terrible. All right, here we go, team. And then did that say 20 of 20? 20 of 20. Let's go find our bun bun friend. That's awful. 10 hours is definitely enough for 100% not counting the three challenge run achievements. Yeah. And I'm definitely going to be doing those off stream. I mean, I have enough time today that I can attempt at least one time of it. Because I do want to try and do the no death run. I think the no death run is much more feasible than people give it credit for. Um, now I have to remember where Bun Bun is. Blasphemous is about 10 to 15 hours. Hey, Dolly the Batty, how are you? I could actually boot up Blasphemous and play that. Plus, they've done a lot of quality of life uh, fixes from what I understand. Because I know one of the big complaints about Blasphemous was the platforming in general. And they've fixed a lot of the uh, edge mick fuck shit that was going on there. I might actually, if I speedrun this, I may switch to keyboard and mouse. Just because it'll be easier to do the frame perfect jumps. Because I can't keep swapping my hand over like I've been doing. Now I just have to remember how to get the bun bun. Ah, shit. Bun! Where you be? Bless this person. And I'm smart. I'm going the correct direction. Alright. So, let's talk, bun. But let's actually see you when you're talking. Ah! More bugs! 
Thanks, kind girl. Here's the reward I promised. Ah, more bugs. Thanks, kind girl. Here's the reward I promised. I got a bellflower. More bugs. All the bugs. I got a hazel badge. Oh, this is a side quest thing. And I got another Passiflora. James versus Games, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope you're enjoying yourself and having a good Saturday. Um, your name is very apt, because that's what we do here. I do Let's Plays of tryhard games and RPGs, and we unpack them a lot. We unpack them, we talk about, like, all the fun stuff that we like about them, we don't like about them, and we try to do completionist things. I'm like... I'm like a small, tiny black version of Gerard, except I'm not nearly as charismatic or appealing. But yeah, that's what we do. They provide my plants with nutrients. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for bringing me all those bugs. All right, let's look at some stuff we just picked up, yeah? So what does... Hmm, hmm? Oh, wait, do I have? Do I have two of those now? Did she give me a Passiflora too? Oh shit, she stat- okay, I get it. The girl that died gave me one. And then this one just gave me three. So I have four full heals on death? Wow. Wow. That makes shit trivial. That makes shit- No, I have four now. She just gave me three. Yeah, I have four full heals on deck. That's absurd. No, you're fine. What's the hazel badge do? I just looked that up and we're about to go find out. So, let's go save. I actually just looked that up because I was like, what the fuck is that, dude? Because I was looking at it for the item list. Yeah, it's a side quest item. I was looking at it in the item list. It's like, it's not in the item list, question mark? And right behind it, it says what's uh, what it's for. Oh, this sucks, though. Um, we might be better off doing this. Dude. Bye. Yeah, this is the smarter play. Hi. Hey, girl. It's Bra Girl. How's it going? Oh, jeez. You're gonna apologize. Hey, that hazel badge! I wonder if you'd be willing to trade it for this special item I possess. Yes! Oh, thank you so much, Echo. Thank you. Um, hold on a second. I'm actually getting into the stress because my back is very sad. Oh! Okay, we're good. And she gives you the blessing charm. Are you ready for this nonsense, Arkrat? Have faith, Kaho. I know things will turn out better soon. You ready for this nonsense? So I have nine bellflowers. Or no, I'm sorry. I have 10 bellflowers. I have four passifloras. And then if I felt so inclined because I don't really need this for the rest of the game, I could put on this blessing charm that had to, um, that cast protective light sorcery. You ready? You ready for what it does? Those will stay there, I think, until they are taken out. Let's go get this better ending, yeah? 
go get this better ending. I need to just go straight up. Like, I quite literally... Description for Blessing Charm says some interesting stuff, by the way. Oh yeah, that's why I left it up, so you can read it. So you can read it. I left it there for like a hot second. But yeah, it's protective light sorcery. Those just circle around me. Actually, let's try it, shall we? Let's see it in action, like real action. Her Highness requests an audience. Uh, I don't need this anymore. I don't care about that. I have so much healing now. I'm just gonna straight up. Alright, let's rage. So we've got this on. It carries through each room. I, I think that counts as unfair. Oh, come on, but I'm not gonna be able to go up? There we go. Oh, I can't go up. Boo. Boo. That's fine. I don't mind going around. It makes the adventure that much better. So let's go this way. And I'll just get this back because I save it each time. Also, did anyone catch that the progress save thing changes its leap too? This is rude. That's rude. Um, yeah, we wanna go up this way. That bitch tried it. Yeah, I, I, I literally can just put this on. It doesn't protect you from projectiles though. Let that be known. But it absolutely will just beat up stuff. Oh, I haven't tried this yet either. I put on something else for the science. Ha! Huh. Oh, wow. They just kind of transport now. Oh, boo. I do have to put on my cat charm for a hot second. Oh, that's fine. Don't hit my kitty. Oh, they try to hit my kitty twice. I'm at that fine point of just not caring now. Because I am like... Borderline... Busted. You think it might drastically reduce the charge? It definitely is like... Like, you see how you don't even watch the animation anymore? Yeah, it's a little bit faster. It's a little bit faster. It's slightly faster. Um, hmm. Oh, I just fucked up. Bollocks. Bollocks and tartar sauce. I should have went go- mm, I gotta fix all that now. Sorry, everyone. Science, uh, science fucked us up. Because now I can't go back. But that's fine. I'm just going to steal their money and go save again. Because then I'll get everything back. Dude. No, I can't do that, though. Quick arrows is immense. Yeah, quick arrows is a mood. I like those. I like those a lot. And they have fire. I was thinking about putting the poison and fire on at the same time, though. Just for shits and gigs. Let's check, yeah? Because it'll give you the bonus damage with the fire. You tried to knock me off of there. Oh, the sound of the kitty when it's damaged. I know, when the cat gets hurt, it's so sad. Oh, 
I don't have to fuck with you. Let's go this way. And we have to remember, we don't want to go down this time. Aha! There are no hurt kitties in this. Now, wait a minute. Oh, fuck you. Okay, I see where I fucked up. Although, if that's the case... Wait a tick. Oh shit, I see what I gotta do. I don't care if you're hurt, you're fine. That was me trying to be efficient and it's not built that way. Alright, that's fine. Uh, I hate when they do shit like that though. Alright, we have to go around this way. We can't go to the left, we have to go to the right. Get out of here. Uh, that was rude. That's fine though. Do, 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 do. Oh, they tried to come from my ankles. Jackasses? Do, 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 do. Yeah, we want to just go up here. I think. Yeah, we just want to go up here. I want to go this way. Bounce on the jellies. Has anyone noticed how there's like an ongoing trope of some of these like games that have women as pro tags have space jelly in them? Like just inherent space jelly? Yeah, it's I don't know. I mean, I'm not against it. I I support space jelly. I always will support space jelly. Oh yeah, this hell room. Let's go ahead and just hold the edges here, because I think that's the play. There we go. Go through you. Go through there. Spice jelly is tastier though. I've never had spice jelly, so I can't speak to that. It's just square boba. I feel inclined to agree with that. Um, so let's see. Let's do the Passiflora. Because now we can be sloppy. Now we can be sloppy. Um, I am going to do the quick arrows, though. I like those a little bit better. It's just weird because I can't see where it's going. Do, 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 do. And let's beat the game again. Yeah, I got an achievement for a 100% map. What you got, girl? Oh, wow. That's like a massive difference. Oh wow, rude.
Yeah, that's a gigantic difference. Oh, we're gonna do this shit now. I mean, if you want to stay there and, and take the L, that's fine. Eh? Alright, so phase one is down, and we still have eight of these. And we're just gonna hold this. The boba place that I go to, Awkward Panda, actually has brown sugar jelly that is legit just square boba. And I remember getting at the first time being like, this bulb is the wrong shape. Ah, crap. Okay, first of all, Lady Rude. Oh, that's fair. Okay, actually, I want to be right here. Do, 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 do. Let it spin, spin, all the spins. What? All right, timeout. That actually makes me irritated. Uh, let's put this back on. Because I like seeing where my arrow is. Cause I'm not keen on missing stuff. You you saw that though, right? That makes me sad. Oh good, we're doing this again. I bet it's yum. Yeah, that was boo-boo. That was the hottest of garbage. Garbage, if you will. There we go. Oh, cool. We're gonna do this again. I could actually- Oh, I'll get a sip of tea. You can thank Metroid for which precedent? I missed that entirely because I hadn't been reading chat. Oh, that was my fault entirely. There you go. Oh. Oh shit. Okay. That's fair. I have no idea what to expect. pick up though. I'm fighting a fucking empty bird cage. I have an armpit itch. Hang on. Time out. Stop. <laughs> I have an armpit itch. Nose itches I can deal with. Face itches I can deal with. The armpit itch that was actually murdering me. That's fine. We gotta switch to those though. I 
think I got it. Yep, I got it. Do we have another form? The cage isn't empty, it's full of revenge! Oh, it's actually like a bird cage. Oh no. Oh, come on. Don't make. Mm, don't. Oh. Uh, mm. Mm, I hate when they do this shit. Girl, you are in a. Mm. I can't be the only one bothered by the fact that her whole ass is barren out there. Did I just seal the curse by putting it in myself? When the curse from east reached the village of Loon, a priestess was sent on a sacred mission to seal it away. The priestess triumphed over the dark, stopping the spread of the curse by drawing it into her body, but she faded away in the process. Are we really doing this trope? We're really... We're really doing this trope. Now only a faint memory of her story remains, passed on as tradition. And then that's how you get to Momodora 1, 2, and 3, huh? Even so, her spirit of determination lingers on, guiding younger priestesses toward finding peace. Yep, this is officially the prequel. And now we get the staff roll. No staff roll for bad endings. No staff for you. Imagine being staff on this and people stop at the bad ending and it's like, no one's going to give us recognition ever at all. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. While this is running, I'm going to check my achievements and see what I have left. We're going to see what I have left. Oh, I have, I have special annoyance. It did call her the sacrificial maiden. Only one person called her that for the record. Because everyone else called her priestess or like pretty girl and stuff like that or her name there was one person that said you're wearing the attire of a sacrificial maiden and it's like oh come on am i gonna die and i died in both <laughs> i died in both the rudeness the disrespect i want to give this person patreon money this guide is really fucking strong this guide is really really good So let's check what we got for achievements. Oh, also not sure if you decided what's happening next, Ben Lurkin, but Blasphemous does have a spooky gory vibe, perfect for Halloween. You know, Kermit, because of how much time I have left, I was thinking of booting up either some Dead Cells or some Hades. I've been playing Hades in like so long. I'm probably garbage at it now. What was I buying? Hey, Sequoia. How are ya? I wasn't buying shit. All right, let's see what we've got here. View my Chivos. Those are both good choices. I think it's nothing but challenge run stuff now. Cause yeah, the things I see are finish a playthrough without killing any enemies, except for bosses. Finish a playthrough without dying. I think that's very feasible. I think that's very, very feasible, to be honest. Um, finish a playthrough on insane difficulty. I don't even think I had that as an option. Hmm. And then there's one hidden achievement. I think I am going to boot up some Dead Cells or some Hades. I didn't need to know that art spit, but now I do. I would have loved to see that when I got there. Said it earlier, but you were busy with the run. Thank you for playing the game. Needed it this week? Of course. It's not a problem. It's not a problem at all. And the game thanks you as well. Dead Cells? I love I love Dead Cells and I love Hades. Those are like my beat your head against the wall roguelikes of choice. I mean, they're both really fucking good. 
They're both really good, and I'm really mediocre at them. Would you like to save over your current file? By doing so, you'll start a new journey from the very beginning with some changes. Oh, yes. I didn't know about this. Time out. Changes how? I would like to know what these changes are. Hello? Hello? Also, who is this person at the beginning? See, look, they called her priestess. Ooh! Oh, wait. I get all of this stuff, though. Pocket and sensory is dope. Not gonna lie. Am I like on hard mode now or curiosity? Okay, so I don't have things that are attached to story progression. So anything that I got from a crest, I don't have. But general items I do have. I think. I noticed some differences. If it makes you feel any better, I'm probably worse at dead cells. And I already have my green leaf. I do notice that. I have my green leaf. I'm curious. I want to see what the difference is. Because it says a few things are going to be different. And I haven't seen anything yet with the exception of... Is my map completion still there? Yep! All of that is still there. Hmm. But it's a fresh file. God, I wish I could pin stuff. I think off the flip enemies have more health. Because they take two shots now. Though they do still take one good smack. Hey, hey, fuck off. And I don't have my cat charm. I have to get that through progression. That one did die to one. I still need, I need to look up what was going on with that one girl that was just like, I have no business with you. Cause I didn't do anything with her. She just doesn't talk to me. She doesn't like me. I can't fully cheese you. But I can still murder you from behind. Yeah, I'm gonna see what one boss looks like to see if I can ID the differences, and then we're gonna boot up probably some Hades. I still have all my ivory bugs, too. Okay, what is this spider for? Why is the spider here? He just here? He just friend? 
hanging out. It's a merchant? Oh, how do I buy stuff from him? Because last time I murdered him. I have no idea. I just like them. Oh, how do I buy the things from him? Well, I'll leave him there. I'll leave him there. Oh, you're fine, girl. You got all types of healing. Oh, I went the wrong way. Derp. Oh, no, I didn't. I went the right way. Okay, I don't think it is more health for enemies. Because now some of them are dying in one hit. I feel like there might be more enemies, because some of them I don't remember being here. I think I'm just on hard now. Also, can I just say that the sound of me killing stuff with the leaf is, like, some of the most satisfying shit in the world? Okay. So, we're back to you. bitter that I got hit. Because I think I could have did that without getting hit. Okay, I have no idea what's different. I have no fucking clue. Um, we're gonna exit. And I know I didn't save. I left that there on purpose. Yeah, the combat sound is absolutely satisfying. I kind of want to see if I can do that no hit. Yeah, and then I got everything in what? That was seven and a half hours? I want to see if I can get this no hit. <laughs> and then we're going to switch to Hades. She's so angry. God damn it. Fuck that. I'm going to Hades. <laughs> I wasn't expecting her to spit right on my fucking face. Um, so let's switch gears. Yeah, we did Momodora. We completed a game in October after hating one and being bugged out on the other. We did get through October and actually beat a goddamn game. So, that means next week we're gonna start something brand spanking new. We're gonna start something brand spanking new. Um, it's still jury still out on what I want to do because I know December we're going to be doing all of Chrono Trigger. We're going to do all of Chrono Trigger. We're going to be doing our technically third, but for the file second playthrough of that so we can get another ending. Who knows? We might be able to get two endings. Um, wait, were you bugged out on Dead Space? Yeah, did you miss that entire conversation? Like, quite literally, I stopped but uh, Dead Space midstream because I literally just had a game-breaking bug. Like, I can't, I can't shoot. The whole Metrovania pixel art never fails. Never fails. It never fucking misses. 
Um, oh, there's an update for Hades. Let me update my Steam as well. Steam. Stream is what I meant, team. I wanted to say update my stream. Um, uh, lots of people playing Watch Dogs right now, which is interesting. Yeah, I haven't watched a stream in a while. Yeah, I left Dead Space because it was a, a bug. You can post a clip. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. That's perfectly fine. I'm just updating my Steam info. Oh, and I can't spell. I wanted to put that. Do, 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 do. Sorry for the awkward silence as well, everybody. I apologize. What? That was weird. Oh, and I just realized you might not be able to see it right away. Because I have to update it. Because that's how we do. But that's easy. That's easy. Do, do, do. Are you, there you go. There you go. Let's see what this is from our crap. I'm going to Hades. Fuck that. That's goofy. Alright, let's see first and foremost if I even remember what the fuck I'm doing. Huh. It says September. Oh no, what's different here? Oh shit, I gotta go through and pick up stuff again, I think. Oh, I just got an achievement. This just had to happen. Is Zach white? I'm interested in cosplaying him in the future, but I don't want to appropriate. I have no idea. I have no fucking clue. Hey Vallejo, how is, how are you? Mm. Thanks for hanging out, Sage. I appreciate you. Have a good rest of your day. Your thumb is perpetually hurting. Oh god, I have to read through this. This is so melodramatic. Wait, what? 
Why are you black? Oh god, I don't want that. I haven't been on this in fucking months. Oh, it's because I was using it last. There you go. Um, Let's get warmed up, yeah? Let's get warmed up. Just notice he doesn't have a tongue. Skelly seems to have a coin in his mouth. Yes! He has a, um... He has a coin in his mouth. And that's why we were in Discord discussing what possibly is the play with Skelly. Like, who does he work for? Because he won't tell you. So we were insinuating that maybe it was certain people here and there. And that's why we think it could be Karen. People were thinking it could be Karen. It could be Achilles. There's an interesting theory for Nyx. Okay, we're good. Yeah, the game audio is real low. I gotta fix it. Oh, I got little chibis. Look at this. Look at these little cuties. Hmm. Oh my god. <laughs> So I said I have stuff that I need to clean up on here. Who the fuck am I missing? Well, yeah, but this isn't like a one-to-one. -one. That's why there was conversations around it. Because based on mythology, he works for the ferryman. But a lot of this is still like, it's accurate but pretty loose. Who the fuck am I missing? Eurydice, Sisyphus, Sisyphus, Eurydice, Patroclus. Hmm. Let's start with Athena. I'm surprised I don't have the thing for her. And then let me do this, because they've changed up everything. There we go, that should be much better. That should be better. Two on the eyes is another one. Yeah, it was, um, there's two on the eyes is one, under the tongue is one. I forget what the other one is. I forget what I was even doing. Okay, no, that's done. I was gonna say, I haven't done zero. I have done zero. Do I really wanna do seven heat even though I haven't played in months? Oh, that can only do two. Um, let's do one of those. I do like extreme measures. And I need one more. Now I'm like, hmm. Because I actually do like buying stuff. Oh, that's awful. 400%? Fucking goodness. I always liked doing this one. Oh, but I love this shit. I will do the speed run. Yeah. 15% is not bad. All right, let's see how we do this. I don't think I'm going to clear it, but, uh, because I'm rusty as shit. 
like my timing is all off and everything and I'm using the Karen bow so I have to remember that my special is going to be my carry honestly I never knew about the eye thing I only heard about the coin under the tongue okay I didn't have one For some reason, I just I just realized that the owl doesn't blink, and now I'm sad. Nine minutes. Oh yeah, and you'll see here in a second, SMB. Fuck! I wanted it to be here. I'm gonna do it, regardless, because that's gonna be my carry. Although the speed run is already kind of coming through. Stay dead next time. Oh gosh, you're still alive? There you go, friend. Keys or gems. I need gems for house shit. Why did I have Courtney play this yesterday with jaw dropping? Oh yeah, he's really good at it. Or oh, I'm sorry, they're really good at it. Um, I, I still love more than anything the bar that he, uh, damn it, the bar that they have at the bottom. Where it's like, um, yeah, I have 370 or 60 hours in this game. I don't need you to tell me how to video games, but thanks. It's like, yo, there's so much mood and energy on that. Hey, Jazz. How are you? I'm going to need some palms for my special. It also helps because the way that they used to have the time, Arkrat, was some of the most infuriating shit. So, fun fact, when you would do the time attacks like this, it used to be, um... There are many vitally important things to do besides lending my aid Half is only at... Nephew, but all of that can wait. Family comes first. Half is only at 300 because he's only been playing it since Steam. I figure if he... Nah, I figure if they've been playing it since, like, Epic, they'd be well over the thousands area. I've never seen this one. I'm not getting good pulls today, though. Uh, threw my back out last night, surviving. Oh, goodness. Are you resting? Strength. My money's okay. Yeah, we want that one. <gasps> it's my babe! It's my babes! I want my Artemis. I want my Artemis. Give me that. I grow so tired of the others here, you know. Girl, a mood. I'd much rather be out with the woodland nymphs than with these gods upon this mountain top. You must know what it's like. Girl, a mood. Ooh. Um. This is what we want. This is exactly what we want. What throws me off is all I was doing was sitting here. Like, I wish throwing my back out would have been literally for any other reason just existing. Yeah, you'll get that a lot. I have to explain that to people when it comes to, like, ACL tears and stuff. I got my ACL tears and it's like, hey, Daggy, thank you so much for the host. Um, is that there are plenty of cases where people have just tore up their shit. Just getting out of their car.
like, literally, Ruth will fall out of her fucking car and tear her ACL. <laughs> Artemis says the men suck. Hmm, it stays on there. Get out of here. I don't want your keys. <gasps> Shit. Athena and Poseidon or another palm. Hmm. Hmm. Now that Artemis has appeared is a good moment to wish everyone a happy ace week. Oh, thank you so much, Nisimbi. I appreciate that. Also, sorry about the person in Discord, too, who's just like, ew. And is like, okay, well, you can leave. That's fine. Uh, do I want a palm or do I want more stuff? Now nah, I want the palm. Because I need to get beefed up fast. There you go. Power of Olympus. Cause yeah, I need to work on these two more than anything. Yeah, it's like having constant back pain, so I have to baby my back already. It's always on the verge of being thrown out. Oh my gosh, that sounds awful. Got some zest. Zest is a good way to put it. I feel like I'm going a bit slow. Ah, that feels better though. That feels a lot better. Yeah, that's the stuff. Anything I need. Lasting consequences. Oh, okay, it's just let me know I have it on there. I was like, pardon? Yeah! But that's fine. Restore up to 24. Mm, it's not even a guaranteed 24. It's not even a guaranteed 24. That's fine, I'll still buy it. Should be handy. Uh, oh shit. Um, let's do the hammer. We're getting some good damage out. There we go. I was like, where are the stuff at? There we go. What do we got? Your special pierce bows and deers plus 400 damage. On a normal day, I would get my triple shot. I would get my triple shot. And thank you so much for the lurk. Let's do special Pierce's foes. Yeah. Yeah. That's the play. In the name of Hades. We're at Meg with four minutes. That's not bad. Ooh. I think this one I haven't done yet. Or did they get rid of that shit? I think they got rid of it. Moons and knockoff effects also do also ruptures foes. I mean that's on my attack. It deals bonus damage to bosses though. Let's do the wave pounding. No, but it's knock away specifically. I'd rather do the dot. I'd rather do the dot. Oh, I've gotten all three? Yes! Oh, I'm fighting Electo. Look at him. That smug look, that posture, everything. Please tell me you're not going soft for this scratch god sister. Wow. Wow. Called out. And Ash, thank you so much for the 100 biddies. How are you today? How are the things and the stuff? I hope you're doing well this fine Saturday. She just went all in. She said, stay the fuck out my sex life. I heard that. How bees you? Hey, Choss, how are you? 
I'm I'm sitting here flabbergasted because I came into a boss fight and old girl came up and was like, this the dude you going soft for? And she was like, why don't you mind your business? And I'm, am I at a boss fight or should I just sit back for a second? She legit just said, mind your business. We here to do some work. I'm gonna need you to stop interrogating me on the clock. Thanks. Wow. Wow, but how are you? How are the things and stuff? Hey, Ravenous. You know, fair point there, Slipper. Very nicely said. Let's kill him now. <laughs> right, Jerry, Jerry. Now, you lucky I like, uh, to Tiffany. Girl, shut up. Yeah, it's all three of them at the same time. That's what a Extreme Measures does, is it makes the boss fights worse. TM. Yeah, it's all three of them at the same time. It ain't that bad. They're just they're just a bunch of blowhards. Um, let's take off Athena. Is this Extreme Measures turned on? Let me never turn that on. I'm great. Got a new PC coming. I'm excited for. Zags is sitting here like, I love it when women. <laughs> I find Electo to be the hardest one. I think she is so freaking boring. So freaking boring. Oh my gosh. You're just good at this game? I'm not as good as some people. By a long shot. By a fucking long shot. Um, who do we want to hang out with? See, I'm not, I don't feel like I'm good enough for that. Maybe we'll do the dodgy plume. Yeah, let's do the dodgy room. But given her presence of three furies is cool though. Yeah, it's really dope. Uh... Ooh, I like that. I'll grab it. Mm. We'll do some boost in. Oh, you're playing Hades and I'm playing DS3? Okay, let's be doing a game exchange program. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you so much for hanging out, Retinos. Um I I you know, I've been with Hades since day one. I just haven't played it that much on stream since the 1.0 release. So I've been behind the scenes the entire time and like helping with stuff. Oh, so I wanted to tell people too, the way that they changed up the timing is a lot better now. It used to be you had nine minutes to clear a section and that was true for every single section. Now the way that they've updated, which I absolutely 100% support, if you have time left over, like I have three and a half minutes left over, that's gonna get stacked on top of the nine minutes for the next area. So the next area, I'm gonna have 12 minutes, 27.56 seconds. Which you know, works because that area is harder. So it might take you a little longer. Oh, got my knee. So let's see if we can get something for casting. Yeah, it's way better. Let that sulfur smell. It's way better that way. Much, much better. Magma is hot. Magma is actually hot. And we got a bonus. Um, ooh, I want the, I want the palm. 
per area, I thought it was for a full run. Oh god, no, 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 no. It used to be nine minutes per area, and now it's nine minutes plus whatever you have left over. Where you at? There you go, friend. Come get shot. I'm also pretty sure that they stole Zag's lines straight from listening to my stream. Ooh, I got fucked up there. This is exactly why I didn't put on Pierce Butterfly, though. Much merriment! Astro Ramin, thank you so much for the 11 months. I appreciate you. You're almost at one year. You're almost at one year. Can we get some hype in chat for the almost one year resub? How are you? How have you been? How are the things and stuff? How are you doing? What's your majiggers? Um, I think there is one that does it for the whole run. There's not. That's that. No, it used. It's been the time for a section. And then I don't think they've ever done one for an entire run. At least in all the early access stuff I did. I never did that. Or if they did, I missed it, and that would have been a terrible idea. Like, that's the only way I could think of that being true is if I somehow missed it. But I don't think they had it for, like, the whole run. Well, now I'm calm. I know there's an extreme level of difficulty. This game would be impossible in nine minutes. Yeah. Like, the fastest runs I've seen, half-coordinated is, like, god tier at this, and they take 20 minutes. They take between 15 to 20 minutes per run. So, like... Yeah, if there was one for nine minutes for a run, anyone who says that they've done that is probably lying. I'm just going to keep that 100. Seven minutes, I think, is a world record run. Nice. Um, we got dollars. Let's go hang out. They did a 10-minute run last night. Nice! Are they doing... What build are they running, if you don't mind me asking? If anyone knows. Don't spend it all in one place, mate. Oh, no. I want to know what their build is. I want to know what their build is. It's down to six, but that's in-game time with pauses and menus and such. Hmm. I've never played this game, watching and learning. Oh god, I love this game. Alright, let's go. They keep doing random weapons and they get and they're trying to get Hermes speed boost plus his damage boost for speed boost. Ooh, I like that idea. See, I'm still spoiled on the original speed run strat where we still were using old school Artemis. But yeah, that's why I was telling people, like, Hades is a game where you have to learn how everything synergizes. If you try to go off of something being, like, cut and dry, you're going to be very disappointed very quickly. Because it isn't all just straightforward like that. I hate these. I hate them. More fun facts about uh, Hades and their builds in early access. Um, once upon a time, once upon a time, it used to be for those blue explodey boys, when you would kill them, those auras didn't fall off. They actually had to go in and put that in as a patch where you would kill the blue guys, but the auras were set on a designated timer. So even though they were dead, everyone would hold an aura for like the set amount of time they were supposed to have it. And then they went in like maybe after a year plus and they were still working on Asphodel and said, hey, when you kill the blue guys, we'll just, we'll just drop the shield. And everyone was like, yeah, that's a much better play. Hmm. Kind of happy that they redid some of the other stuff. So having a lot grandma. I love grandma. Grandma's dope. Grandma is very easy to get shit busted on. Telling you right now though, 
liking the direction of this fucking dash. Holy shit, that's nice. Like that dash. Holy shit, that's a really nice upgrade. Um Yeah, we could use some we could use some bandages for our face. I really fucking like that. Holy shit. No idea how to. I think it's an overtime thing. I'd have to double check. I'm not sure because that was a <gasps> Hi friend! You're back. I thought you made it out. No matter. Why you say that like you don't like seeing me? I got caught by the tiny hydras. I'm gonna need band-aids because I'm taking a lot of damage. We make a decent team. I mean, if you consider hard carrying a decent team, sure. Took down more than I, did. I took down triple the amount you did, my guy. Low-key cute? No, they're extremely cute. They're extremely cute. Just what I need. Hmm, this might get rough. Because I have just under, just over half of my health. Nine minutes for a full run is absurd. Goddamn. Yeah, you have to really, really know the mechanics of the game. It's one of the reasons why when I see people get really shitty and angry and being like, I wish this build worked this way. It's like, I mean, it's really about understanding mechanics. <gasps> oh, I'm on the new chamber. Like, right now, my damage output is still kind of low. Oh, Vanessa, get your feet out the lava. Like, my output could be better. I also could not set my feet on fire. I really like this chill effect though. I might lose a Death Defiance because I'm playing sloppy. I'm playing like real sloppy. There we are. What do you mean you can't be serious? Yep, there we go. Bonk Hydra is best. Uh, I'll get to you in a second, Astro. Like I said, though, I'm super rusty at this right now. I probably shouldn't have done 7 Heat. I might have to go back and get another one of my... All your heads are dead. <laughs> Shut up. Learning Bonk Hydra is so cute. I haven't experienced any lag. Is the stream lagging for anyone else? Is it my connection? It's my OBS. It's my OBS. How good How good is this bow? Just looking at it, thought it was only okay and instead fell for Haribo. Fell for a heart. Haribo is real strong. Haribo is real fucking strong. Don't sleep on that. Real strong. I still don't have a cast. 
I just realized my build's actually not that great, and I'm progressing okay-ish. Um, it's frame sweeping a tiny bit, but it's not bad at all. Yeah, it's OBS's side, because they don't know how to build stable anymore. Um, then what did you even do? Right. I just saw your comment, Yeti, and it's exactly that. It's like, oh, we make a great team. I have 13 to your four. I have 13 to your four, but okay. I'm working on my last drawing. Inktober has been very therapeutic for me. Good. I'm gonna have to go to Hermes. Strong woman got strong bows. Hera got them good strong bows. But yeah, I need a couple of changes. Cause I either need to get some more palms or I need to get um, some more of my build. But yeah, this bow, um, you're asking how good is it, Ebony. This bow is particularly strong if you get a good special. So if you can get like a really strong special or a really boosted special, it can get really gross. You'll be fine, Hermes. Damn, okay. Whenever you're hit, you have a chance to dodge automatically. You move faster. I really don't care about money that much. I get enough to get health and that's all I really care about. I need to get one of my death defiances back. I just hit my stride and I was like, I see, cast and shoot them. Yeah, Elysium is like gross. I cleared through three, heat three through six back to back with the Haribo and Desperate Measures three alone. Oh, I believe it. Gotta put the vampire princess in our costume. All right, awkward, I'll be here. Yeah, the Haribo is not something to sleep on. If you like crit builds, then the Haribo is absolutely stellar. Um. If you like more power builds, then you want to look at something else. But if you're someone that like operates on crit. Oh, the tiny chariots. That was my fault entirely. That was your fault though. Sorry, I forgot how to boot, use the bow for a hot second. What the fuck was that? That was a weird noise. Uh, ooh, that's gross. That's gross. I could do that one. Not the tiny chariots. I hate the tiny chariots. I hate Elysium in general. Um... Mind for everyone today to get on Animal Crossing? Oh yeah, I gotta get on that. I gotta charge my Switch. Will you give me the lob? Because the lob will be nice. Hey, Keen. Hey, PT. Happy Halloween. Hope you're having a lovely Saturday. I'm having a great Saturday. Well, I don't care about that. Let's go get some stuff. Yeah, the chariots are shit. Oh, are you really gonna do this? Game. Seriously? That was boo boo. Oh, God. I said I just don't like Elysium. With every enemy that comes through, I'm like, oh yeah, I hate this one too.
I hate this one too. They both were rearming. What are you talking about? Halloween events from 5 to 12. Okay. I need to hop on there. Why do you keep trying to give me that? The Shield Boys are the bane of my life. Yeah, the Shield Boys are pretty bad too. I'm not sure I'm going to get a clear on this. I hate that I just did that, but I don't think I'm going to get a clear on this. Because I'm not doing too great. Hey, Artie! Thank fuck. Ooh. Those are both really good. Sorry, Poseidon. You know the saying not to play with fire, don't you, nephew? Sorry. Love you. Oh, yeah. Who told you you can make more? Would you like some jasmine tea? We have some nice leaves in the back. You don't have to throw water at me. <laughs> I have to take this. Because I'm not doing great at all. Ooh. Is it going to be the butterfly or is it going to be Asterius? Let's find out. I might die. It's a serious. You come short one. Come on, Asterius. We fought how many times already? What's this? No, I dreamed, and in my dream, there was something I had to. Yes, we just got another one. You have to tell the weapons you wear on your hands. Yes. Tell them. This get this run is not for naught. And make peace with death. This run is not for naught. It's not for naught. So if I die here, it doesn't matter because I just opened up another weapon. Think you mean best Pompadour Boyo? I think I'm missing one waking phase. Hey, I know what that is. That's a waking phase. So I'm to speak to Malfon. Wait, why are you helping me? Right? I don't know whether I'm helping you or not. But in my dream, an ancient hero fought a beast of a man barehanded. They became friends in the end, after a great battle. I long for a fight like that. Oh, can we move Asterius to soft boy column? Is Asterius soft boy now? Serious?
Oh, boo. I got hit by the backswing. He should be getting ready to spawn down. Because he's not going to let me actually kill him. Yep, there he goes. I want to be friends, though. You said... Why you call that man out? Oh, I got another plume. Ooh. Oh, you're rude. You're so rude, game. That's... That's not nice. Because I could use both of these right now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna take this. There's other ways to get Death Defiances back. I'm gonna take that. I was like, where the fuck are the enemies? Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the follow. I can't see your name quite right now, but I appreciate you and I want you to know that. I'm just in the process of trying to live through Hades? You're not regenerating though. Give me the dollars. Shit. Poseidon or Hermes? I might do Hermes. Open hostility. Thank you so much for the follow. That's quite the name. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, let's see if I can get some uh, band-aids on my face. I can't. I can get that at least. Um, I was say... I have some good names that come through here. Uh, currently, the top tier winner is for Booty Slapper. Uh, someone joined the channel named Booty Slapper. I mean, it kind of speaks for itself. So, y you know. Uh, there's also another top tier one is Feed Me a Stray Cat, which is a reference to one of my favorite corny ass movies. Oh, you're right here. Ain't none of y'all dropping sandwiches. Oh, there's a sandwich. The himbo fight's gonna be rough. God damn. Oh, you're kidding me. Actually, that helps a great deal. Yeah, can you handle that, please? <gasps> no, it blocks that. All right, well, then give me this. Oh, I'm getting, like, all types of achievements all over the place, which is fine with me. I'm going to use another one, I think. I can't believe that it actually eats through that. Like, I can't express to you how ashy that makes me. And there's shield boys here. This whole room is awful. Oh, you'll be fine, Than. You get one more attempt. Shit. 
Shield boys plus butterflies plus blue guys was actually really rude. Oh, thank fuck for that, though. Um, let's just do this. Yeah, the shield boys are annoying. But I just don't have good damage output for this. As I then immediately eviscerate someone. I was like, where the fuck is he? Oh, you can sit right there. Yeah. Because I think I'm going to eat up a lot of my time. Just trying to do um, the boss of this area. I got a sandwich. I seen it. There we go. I can go to... I'm gonna run the risk. I'm gonna run the risk. Gotta go fast. I can go faster. My build's not very good. I have enough. Those are top priority, though. I think I'm gonna need more than five. I might not need more than five minutes, but I'm not gonna get the padding I want for the final area, which sucks. I want that. All right, let's do it. Let's see what we got. We're gonna go for bull first. Wow, we're standing up for our we're standing up for our cow friends. Standing up for our cow friends. Shield boys annoy me, but I'm also amused that our Mr. Cast True Shot ignores shields because of course it does. Hmm. And Mars425, thanks so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Yeah, I would say he always talks. Let Asterius talk. Let Asterius get the shit talking. Technically, you just did. And I too shall oblige. That is, oblige my trusty spear, which yearns to penetrate your soft and vulnerable, altogether pallid flesh. Now die. Cool, 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 cool. We're not going to talk about the wording on that or nothing. We're just going to let that sit out there for the world to just absorb. Cool. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, that was my fault. My timing was off. I'm 
I'm getting my button combinations mixed up. Because I'm so used to doing charge shots. That I keep trying to charge my Y. Yeah, I thought that was gonna be the case. I think this is my last attempt. But all in all, I don't feel bad about this run. I did make some progress. It's just my damage output is too low to be meaningful. Also, can I just say I really enjoy all the remixes of songs that they've done? Will you? <laughs> Sorry, that just was really funny to me. I might die here. It's been a long time since I've died to, um, what is this man's name? Damn, it's Zeus? Rude. Never mind, I'm not dying to Theseus. Never mind, I'm not dying to Theseus. Theseus can continue to eat shit. Oh, and I still walked out with two minutes. I just need to figure out how to get my death defiances back now. Because Patrocles is off the table. I have to get them back from like Athena and a tooth. Although, what's my, um... What is my... Oh, I didn't want that. Or that. Buttons. Buttons are hard. Really? It's only at a four? Hmm. I could change that then. Whoops! If that's the case, I'm going to go ahead and do the tooth. I've gotten to the point where I'm fine dying to the rats immediately after Theseus, but I refuse to give Theseus satisfaction. A mood. If I can kill Theseus, I'm counting it as a successful run. Don't care. Um, can I say I really hate the tiny rat mini boss? Like, oh yeah. The mini bosses for the rat are real annoying. There, we have one now. That might be our- Oh, I'm too poor! That's fine. My damage output is just not good for this. So I don't have a lot of confidence going in. I'm not going to front. I'm almost out of there. But we'll see how far we can get. I haven't even attempted fishing. I haven't been listening out for the sound either, though. Like, I haven't even attempted listening for the sound. The tiny vermin is hella cute, though. They're super cute. They still suck, however. Oh, there's fish, but eh, I don't care. Oh, I didn't realize I didn't have a good health pool either. I usually try to go into Hades with 200. That's awkward. Um, hmm. I bet it's in here. Open it! Open it! 
There we go. There's that. I was gonna say, can you die? I'm on a timer. Can you not? That was a pretty sexy room, though. Like, that that was real fucking smooth. Lady Demeter. Here you go. Have some soda. I am forever in your debt for the affection that you've shown to me and for the power you've bestowed. Yeah, uh, Tiny Rat fucking sucks. I also hate the satyr bosses. I hate the satyrs. Period. The everlasting winter means that nectar's been in rather short supply. That you would think of me for such an offering is duly noted, then. In the name of Hades... Choo Choo thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a fantastic Saturday. Thanks for joining. Poison sucks. The poison is shit. Hmm. This is dangerous because it does technically count. Hey, Shrimp, how are you? How have you been? Although I don't have... Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with this. I would do rare crop if I got it early. Actually, Anna, how are you? Welcome on in. Okay, I'm good. Had chemo yesterday, but good. How are you? I'm, uh, do I speak French? Not well. I can get through it very, very slightly. Uh, technically speaking, it'd be like, un peu? And of course, captions is going to try and read French, and it doesn't know it. But otherwise, I'd say no. Oh my god. Is this me being tested on my French? Is this college being forced to come back to the forefront? Uh... What do I want? I think I want a palm. I think I want the palm. That's what I said, Tavo. Doesn't taste like anything. Thank fuck for that. God damn it. Oh, it's cleared itself. Cool. What do we have here? Just what I need, except. Yeah, God, you're so right, though. Um, we're gonna spend some money on that, though, because that'll actually be helpful, all things considered. Get out of here. Thank fuck. Power of Olympus. Holy shit! Oh, it's a double, that's why. I was like, what the hell? Um, let's do pressure points. Let's drink dirty water. Let's get the hell out of here. Hi, Karen. Bye, Karen. Let's see what we can make out of this. 
I, again, I'm not expecting a clear. I have one death defy. I love you, Zag. There you are. Then let us now commence this ugly business yet again. It's very good. Yeah, Hades is very good. get that one. I've heard the date. Oh, <laughs> he's so irritated. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that was the. I think that's my new favorite dad kid argument to date. What happened? I looked away a second. They're fighting, right? And while they're fighting, they yell at each other. This is very often. This always happens. And this exchange in particular just took me out because he's like, how dare you fight me thinking that you can just walk away. And Zag is like, I am going to walk away. And I am going to walk away. You got like, you know what I want. And he just yells, I do, you imbecile. And I just, I'm sorry. It just was funny to me. I just, I saw that meme of like the two dudes who are like arguing and they start like slamming chairs and shit. That whole meme just like flashed through my brain while they were talking and that's why I was laughing so hard. Oh my God. Oh, that was funny. Okay, focus face. The <laughs> I just envisioned that while they were yelling at each other. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by that. I thought that was going to get through and I was going to be so shitty. There's one up top. Damn, I have another one of these.
Ah, almost got through first phase. Both boring as heck, so mixing up the two is not that important. Oh, was it that? I always get confused. The motorcycle dad and son. Uh, let's see. I need someone to make that an actual meme. That meme exists. That meme legitimately exists. Oh, what is Pawn Stars? It's, um, it's kind of a shitty American show, is the best way to describe it. Oh, shut up. It's a shitty American show. Yeah. Oh, I knew I wasn't going to make it far. Oh, yeah, he stays up there if you don't kill him. But this works. Infamous, thank you so much for the 100 biddies. I appreciate you. How are you? How have you been? Let me call my pal who specializes in antique horseshoes for goats and get a price for that. Oh my gosh. What does she care? I talk to everybody around here at least a bit. It's not my business, Eric. I'm not even producer. How is this my fault? I was gonna say, like, what the fuck? Where is Nyx? Hold on. Not everybody knows exactly how to give you pets and live to tell it, right, boy? There's a pet the puppy. Yeah, you pet the three-headed puppy. He's so cute. All right, let's try again. Let's do the hair bow. Although I kind of want to work on the Chiron bow still because I'm not that good at it. Been meh, but surviving. How about you? There's a mood on that. Mirror of night. There's a mood on that. Oh, I know why. I need a Deusa plushie. I need it. I need it. What you want, Skelly? Skelly, I'm serious. If you really won't tell me anything about you, you're just going to leave me to speculate forever. Yep. Mmm. <laughs> wakey, wakey. Ready, Exegrip? Mm. It's not you. It's not you. Oh, it's. I think it's you. No, you're Guan Yu. Whose aspect do I have? There we go. It didn't do it last time. You see, I picked him up. You see, I picked him up and nothing happened. I was like. I thought Malfon was fist. Gilgamesh. That actually sounds kind of dope. Do I just want to try these? I need my farm and get something to eat. Bye, chat. Bye, Nessa. Later, Echo. Thank you for hanging. I appreciate you. I kind of want to keep playing with my bow, though. Oh, that helps. That explains a lot. Oh, I forgot what Mignon is. Deuces very funny is droll. Petite's just small. Oh, I forget what Mignon is. Oh my goodness. I gotta run. Have a good stream. Alright, Ebony, thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you. Have a good rest of your day. Thanks for hanging. Hmm. 
is cute. I thought it was cute. I didn't want to be wrong. I didn't want to be wrong and assume. But Dusa is very cute. Thank you. Let's try again. Oh, wait. But I don't need the tooth. Take the tooth off. Get that out of here. Say no to tooth. Hmm. The boy? What do you mean the boy? There's many boys here. Oh my god. I really hope they sell the chibi faces as stickers. I know what Le Garçon is. <laughs> also, can we talk about how this is something I see all the time that happens in games and I actually get really angry about it. How people use garçon to mean waiter and the actual meaning of it is boy. And people always look at me like I'm the one that's weird. And I'm like, I literally studied French for like four years total. And every time garçon came up, it was boy. It was never waiter. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> I know it's true. It makes me mad. <laughs> And I hear it in games all the time. They're like, Garcon? I'm like, that's it. That means boy. <laughs> I don't know what I want to start with. Maybe I'll start with Poseidon. Although I've heard Aphrodite's been better. Let's stick around with Aphrodite. Hey, Edelweiss. How are you? So what did I do last time? I need one more, though. Let's do that instead. Girl, may I say you're looking exceptionally fierce as fuck today? Oh, thank you so much, Ada Weiss. How have you been? How are the things in the stuff? I want everyone's stickers. That feel when Aphrodite is trying to politely reach out to you. I don't know about that one, boss. Had a really bad week at work, unfortunately, but thank you for asking. That's Boo Boo. Everything about that is turds. Damn. I mean, if that's how we starting, that's how we starting. Maybe we should get some chaos boons. Oh, that's just for money. Ooh, let's get this going. Why are you still alive? You eating my clock, son. Shit, I need to give her soda. <laughs> Anna, please. Yeah, this week has been just rough, I think, for everyone, which is unfortunate. Unfortunate. Damage and completely chill? But also, this is here. If I could get her on this in my attack, that would be kind of gross. I want the dash, though. Crap. There's only the gems. Okay. 
And I apologize if there's moments where it looks like I'm not reading chat. I'm just, I'm kind of in speedrunner mode, but not really. It's weird to explain. I'm just like constantly racing the clock. Hey, don't touch me. Hey, welcome back, Volt. How are you? You are... You are very... You are good something. Oh, oh! I, I'm really just trying. Uh, do I want Zeus or do I want... Ares? Mmm! Thank you so much for hanging out, Arkrat. I didn't see that. I appreciate you. Have a good rest of your day. I think I'm going to play till 6. I think I'm going to play till 6, and then um, we're going to call out. I'm about to sit down and work on my Man of Madame Platinum trophy, so I'm going to make a playthrough where all the rich white people die horrifically, and then working class black girls save the day as a sole survivor. Oh, God. Thanks for a great stream. Catch all of you in the Discord. Oh, if you're in the Discord and I haven't rolled you yet, I'll get to you once we're done with stream. Um... Zeus will give me lightning things. Let's do Zeus. That and this will actually be a good damage tester. Yeah, this build is already much better. All right, Chavo, be well. Have a good rest of your day. Zeus an asshole. I kind of want that. Oh, gosh. Let's do that. I was like, yeah, that was, this build is already doing a lot better. Oh, no, it's Daddy Chaos, though. There we go. All right. Yeah. What you got? Hit me! I love you, Chaos. Yes. Yes. My cats bother me when I'm in the bathroom all the time. All the time. 24-7. Like, literally, if I wake up to go brush my teeth, Funky will race and fucking fall over my feet to get in the bathroom and be like, Wait, I gotta be in here first. Oh my gosh. Hey, SJ. How are you? That and I, I don't know if it's TMI, considering probably everyone's guilty of it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I have two cats. Their names are Simon and Garfunkel, but we call Garfunkel Funky. Per usual, neither one of them is in here. <gasps> oh, that says cast. Never mind. I need it to be special. Oh, that's no good. This is probably my best bet. Chaos 
doing good. It was just Halloween with the kids at work. Oh no, I can't collect those. Um Nah, I'm not buying any of this shit. Oh, let's go hang out with Poseidon though. Ooh, I should have checked that. He's a bitch. I hate this man. That's rude as hell. And I'd be shitty about it too. Um, I'm like halfway deep in a month as player and I don't try too hard to lie. You hate Ocean Dad? No, I love Ocean Dad. But he's saying that Zeus told Poseidon, him that Theseus was his kid, and that's grounds for whooping somebody's ass. I'm not gonna front. I'd look at him and be like, yeah, I'd beat your ass. I would beat your ass. Mm. Thank you for the stream. Not a problem, Anna. Thank you so much for hanging out and also working with me and my pathetic French. Thank you for forcing me to think about that stuff. I've been meaning to get back into it, so that kind of was a good reminder. Have a good rest of your day. Um, let's see. Happen to be safe. Thanks so much, stream. I'm off to supervise socially distanced trick or treating. I believe in you. Have faith. Be safe. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, I mean, it's Zeus being a shitty troll is kind of his thing. It's true. Have a good night, Anna. Um, I think I want this still. Zeus told Poseidon that Theseus was Poseidon's kid. Yeah, Tunix. Also, how are you, boo? I haven't seen you in a hot minute either. I hope you are well. Actually, you know what? I'll try this. I'll try this. Oh, thank you. Oh, I guess we're gonna go shopping. Fighting. It's to Symphony! Hello. Hi! Murder. That sounded kind of sexual. Oh, Electo, fuck off. I was gonna say, switch it. Bye, Tiffany. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that I understood that right. And hi, Twisted. I'm hanging in, just trying to be as low-key as possible so that 2020 doesn't notice me and gets extra shitty. Ed, I mean, there's a lot of mood and energy on that. I, I just, yeah, I think that's a good way to put it. I don't want 2020 to be real notice me, senpai. Matter of fact, 2020 can just not notice me at fucking all. That'd be great. I, I'm only taking applications for glow-ups. Um, still need an attack boon. So who are we rocking right now? We've got some Zeus. We've got some Aphrodite. 
I wouldn't mind putting Ice Grandma on my attack. That would actually make me happy. Should help. Hopefully helps. Don't want that. I don't want that at all. Oh, what's this? The path from Tartarus is finally laid bare. Far above, the heat from Phlegathon, the river of flame, is faintly felt already, even as its dangers lie in wait. Let's explore. every time this is Hermes yeah please don't notice me give me the globes with like conferences panels all that good shit otherwise if you just want to not see me I was like where the fuck is the enemy uh oh we got little cuties mad at that spawn. Oh, that's fixed. Hey, Jenna. How are you? How have you been? How are the things and stuff in your side of the world? I hope you are well. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, all of these are just shitty. Um. Oh, I do like that, though. I'm Swell, how are you? I could fish. Mm, I'll get a fish. Always time to fish. And the timer stops. No. No. There we go. Just a crustacean. Hermes be like, I let the old man get a march on me so he can feel good about himself. Oh my god. They're always messy. Oh, this is Eurydice. Let's get some upgrades. Fishing in lava. Oh, wait until we have to fish in uh, the chaos realm. Then you're fishing literally in the uh, in the other. What's your official business anyway, your royal you're fishing in the other. It's wild. Girl, give me some of that porridge though. I love Eurydice's design. Along the way, but I think I will make it there eventually. Nisimbi, I hate you. I fucking hate you. <laughs> oh really? Say no more. I know how that is. Mm-hmm. She's adorable. I love like the the ponytail afro they gave her. I think I want the porridge. Now I want the porridge. Careful, it's hot. Wow, that's good. I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. See you next time. Well, I know it's a tree, but it's also like formulated in the shape of an afro on purpose. Like that's literally something Gen Z herself has came through and said. It's a tree, but it's also an afro. Needles may scare me, but I expect good tattoos when I see them. Um, let's see. I think we're going to do piercing volley. Oh, in reference to Eurydice's tattoos. I was wondering where that comment came from. I was like, I don't think I've thrown up the Space Invaders in a while. I'm confused. Yeah, I want this. Oh, there's my babes. Is it going to be Hydra Head or Boat? We are Hydra Head.
Give me my stuff. Give me attack. Yes, that's what I wanted. Chill plus weak. All right, we're getting, we're making some progress here. We're making a build now. Real build hours. If we can get something that actually can get chill to stack and then explode, now we're gonna be in business. <gasps> Finn! It's time. Hi, boo! Got little more to do there, huh? Well, there's no need to summon me this time. I just. I love Than so much. He went from edgy irritant to just straight up cute boy. Hey. No, that one's mine. Who dies next? Ah! Nope, those are mine. Has to be the last of this lot. Shit. Oh no, I might lose! I lost because I fucked up. Oh boo. I don't think I've lost to him in a while. Eh, it needs 10. <gasps> Ooh. Hmm. I love this game, maybe a little bit too much. I have certain feelings. Hey Theminus, how are you? Um, I have certain feelings about it because for all the people who are coming through now and they're just like, oh my god, Hades is so good. I want to sit there and not be that salty bitch, but to be a little salty. I want to go out to people and be like, you remember when I was trying to tell y'all like a year and a half ago that, ye uh, that Hades was dope? And y'all told me that it didn't look like it would be good. It looked like another Dead Cells clone. You weren't sure if you trusted it because it was early access. And now all of a sudden you're all just like gushing all over it. You remember that? You remember? Because Pepperidge Farms remembers. I told you this. Hello? This game was out for a year and a half. Something, something, but epic client something. Yup. It was in, um, Jenna, it was in early access for two years almost. And uh, they had one year exclusivity with Epic. So everyone like, oh, Neon Sailing. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate you. Hang on, I'm gonna talk about it in a second. Hello everyone from Saline Stream. I'm Pleasantly Twisted. I'm a black queer content creator. I'm a, um, I do try-hard games and RPGs. And um, today we beat Momodoro Reverie Under the Moonlight. We're working on our 100% file. Got most of our stuff is done. And then we switched over to finish our stream with Hades. So now we're trying out a Hades run. Um, how is everybody? I hope y'all doing well. Um, but yeah, so it was in early access for a year. How are you today? I'm well, Miss Pinky. How are you today? And we're talking about how Hades is in early access, but so many people slept on it because it was on the Epic Store. And so then it finally came over to sh the Steam for like the final few months of early access. And people were still like, oh, well, we don't want to buy it because it's not done yet. Okay, that's fine. But now the game is out and seeing people all up and down my timeline just being like, oh my God, it's so good. I'm like, I've literally been saying that for a year and a half. I have literally been saying that for a year and a half. Exactly. It's some of the weirdest fucking shit. Been a super fan of Jan Pirate fan for a while. First game of theirs for me was Transistor. The soundtrack gets my music nerd going every time. Oh my god. I've been with Supergiant since the Bastion days. So I already knew what the game was. And people were just like, oh, we're not sure. And then what gets me even more is that people are all up on Hades. And then the one that comes through, which, good for them. Yeah, uh, good for them. Um, that they're getting into more super giant games and stuff, but I just looked and I was like, yeah, this is their fourth game. They've been averaging a game every three years for 12 years. They just passed up their 10 year anniversary. I was trying to decide, do I want more gods or do I want, I don't really want anything with them. So I want Palm. And it's, it's a weird thing, right? Because I don't want to sound like I'm upset or ungrateful because that's not the thing. But at the same time, it's just, it's the weirdest shit. Because people were really into this whole thing of being like, I don't want to do it because it's on Epic. I don't want to do it because it's early access. They just kind of quietly convinced themselves that it's going to be bad. And then it's not. 
And then they want to be mad when... Oh, you just was the other. And then they want to be mad when, like, all these other people have all this info about the game. And they're like, how do you know all this? Because I've been around it for, like, two years. Legit. Literally been around for two years. Supergiant is the only company I hand money without thought. Yeah. Yeah. I've yet to be, um... I've yet to be disappointed by them. Hermes, money, palm. Palm. Yeah, when I first saw Hades, I was like, put it on Switch and I'll get it. Supergiant, I was like, all right, bet, fork it over, right? And that's the other thing too. Supergiant is such an A-plus company when it comes to listening to their actual population because it's like they released it and this is something I've been saying more on panels and stuff too when it comes to like actual engagements with industry one of the ashiest things i see people do all the fucking time is let's say devolver digital pushes out a game announcement tomorrow i don't even care what the game is i don't care what the game is about they just say hey here's a game about goat cheese and it's going to be out on pc without fucking fail it's a fucking 10 minute turnaround when some ashy clown shoe fuck shows up and is like, so when are you putting it on Switch? And it's like, <sighs> and it's, and it, it doesn't have to be Switch. It's always something like that. It'll be like, this is coming out on PS4 and Xbox. So when are you putting it on PC? <sighs> <laughs> and there's like the people who are excited like you are arachnavolt who's like oh fuck yeah i want to support the fuck out of this this is my preferred location and and you know this is like what i want and i'm still going to support you i'm still going to signal boost you i'm still going to let people know about you and all this other stuff but then there are just those those fucking swaths of them that slide through and literally just they don't even want to give them any time of day unless it's exactly where they want it. And I'm like, every passing day that a company doesn't deny you shit because you ruin gaming for everyone, I am impressed. Mm. I'm waiting on for the cloud saves to get done. Are we playing AS goat cheese or are we making the goat cheese? Yes. <laughs> yes. How are you doing, Lunas? Because if you do, do do give it to Devolver and they'll do it. But if you don't, shut up and they'll get there when it gets there. Between folks being disrespectful to game devs and being super entitled, I just want to be like, squ I'm not a game dev. I can only speculate so much. I just like video games and I like dissecting video games. But every time I see this shit happen, I just want to go in the comments and be like, every single one of you anime avatar looking fucks in my mentions right now. Square up. Square, square the fuck up. Square up. Square up, dog. Come on. You want to act bold and bougie? Square the fuck up. Right now. Right now. Do it. Oh, it's Dreadlock Lurney. Where are they coming from? I think that's my new game title. I think I'm gonna be a game dev bouncer. I'm gonna be a game dev bouncer. I will also fight those. <laughs> That's another phrase I don't put enough fucking mileage on. Fucking fight me, nerd. <laughs> Games come out on the platforms they come out on. You can get mad about that all you want. If it ain't fun for you, you can stop, though. Uh, let's see. When are you going to put X out on Steam? You got Steam dollars? Oh, okay, bet. Shut up. Like, people complaining about Cyberpunk. Oh, my gosh. Honestly, I support early access as a model. Not all the projects I put money into were successful, but I have empathy for how hard it is to produce a game. The other thing about it is early access done correctly is specifically to get it into the hands of people who are willing to take the risk to actually go through the learning and building process with you. Fucking fight me, nerd. Fight me! Hang 
on. I'm going to show up on the fucking field in the straight out of Nibelheim shirt being like, square the fuck up, nerd. Fight me. Oh, we ain't got it. No, we do got to. You had that good shit. You was talking through your chest when you was on your keyboard. Fucking fight me right now. Get over here and square the fuck up. Square up. You you got everything figured out and you know what the fuck's good. Square up. What's Gucci? Oh, you're not trying to square up? Then you need to shut the fuck up and quit making all these demands for shit you ain't trying to do yourself. Thanks. Yeah, because, like, I love Sonatica, beat the PS4 version, never once expected the Switch version, so the announcement for the first one and Below Zero was awesome. Keyboard Warriors, real quiet, face-to-face. -face. Rocks up in a Jeff Rosen stock shirt ready to fight a nerd. Right, fucking fight me, nerd. Fight me! <laughs> I'll introduce you to a brick. Keep playing. I have complaints about Cyberpunk, but for other reasons, and I'll leave it at that. Yeah, the list of reasons for that is extensive. But also the boss fight baseline is choice. Yes. Yes, the fuck it is. Crowdfunding is basically supporting an idea versus a finished product. There's risk for sure. Yeah, going into EA, I want that on a shirt. Oh, which one, Jenna? Fucking fight me, nerd. I can make that a shirt. I can make that a shirt. Fucking fight me, nerd. And it'll be in fancy script. Not that I would wear it, but I... <laughs> See, I would wear it. I would wear it. It could be this text, and then it would be like the fancy script, like all of my panels and shit. And it would just say, fucking fight me, nerd, and have a glass of wine on it. Fucking fight me, nerd. What do you want to do? I wish there was a way... I wish there was a way to do something like that. And then like on the back in the collar area right here, I could put like the wine cellar heart so people know who you got that from. <laughs> oh, this bitch says that? All right, go on her Haiti stream. Fight me. Not that script, but uh, look at my panels. The uh, fancier script than that. My conservative upbringing comes out when it comes to me wearing profanity. Oh, that's fair. See, it's I'm only that way when it comes to my dad because my dad doesn't curse. My mom cursed like a sailor though, so I got a lot of that from her. But now I just curse with conviction. And I'm just like, fucking fight me, nerd. And it's like, the fuck you mean you not gonna go vote? I don't... Interesting. 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 Don't get fucked up in this house. You need to go hit the fucking buttons and stop acting real brand fucking new. Like, that's, that's my brand of profanity. I curse you out because I care. All right, let me fight this. Wow, head bonk Bernie is way worse than this one. Hit it. Mmm. Mmm. That's a lot of damage. Come on over here, Lernie. Come on. Quit thinking. Come over here. Why? What What are you doing, Lernie? Besides killing my clock. Lernie. All right, fine. Bring it here. Shut up. Bougie King? Where you at, Bougie King? Ooh, my health is not looking great. Ooh, we made it. I love that Ebert. Wish I was able to buy games, but while that happens, I'm gonna be here just hyping because they're so great. Hey, that's valid. That's valid too. Yo, realness, something that makes me real ashy real fast. Real ashy real fast. People who hop into streams of games they don't like just to let people know how much they don't like them. Sis, why? Swiss why, sis why, bougie, do you need this, like what, I just don't know what it's like to be so unmoisturized, really, you went into a stream of a game you don't like, to complain about it, really, that's the energy you bring in, mm, couldn't be me, could not be me, you still on, I was feeling real down, took a nap instead of coming, I still didn't miss it. Hey, Bougie, I'm glad you, how are you feeling after your nap? 
How are you feeling after your nap? You came here by choice to be unhappy. Oh, could not be me. You hate to see that. You could be watching a game you do like. You could be hanging out in a channel with people you do like. You could be streaming. The list of things you could be doing to bring you joy and everlasting happiness is extensive and long. And yet all these flavors are present and you chose to be salty. Mm. Can't relate. Can't relate. You will never catch me being so unmoisturized. I cannot. Some people don't know what joy is. <laughs> the truth on that. Sounds like the only cure for that level of ashiness is an insta <laughs> Why the heck would someone waste their time being spiteful? Like I said, all these flavors and you choose to be salty. Couldn't be me. Could not be me. Um, Let's go ahead and get this dodge rate up. I still don't know what constitutes quickly because there's not really an answer. I have enough for both. Let's get it. Oh, shit. But that's nice, too. Mm. All right. Gain a random item offered from the Well of Karen. We ready? You ready? What do I get? Oh, what's a Chimera jerky? Oh, no, that's my fault. Let's go out and be fucking violent. But yeah, I just... The level of just absolute ridiculosity that some people will do in channels is something I just cannot relate to on any level whatsoever. Mm-mm. Hmm. A damage boost, you say? It's my favorite. The only thing I like more than that is when my damage boost gives me money. Come up off your coins. Don't make me whoop your ass. Hey, Dance. Dan Dance Macabre. I said Dance, and that's Dance. How are you? Welcome back. I hope you're doing well. I don't get it. Some of my favorite streamers will play games I just like, and I just don't won't join that day or or another thing bougie that i find myself doing sometimes i like that person so much that i kind of don't give a fuck what they're playing i'm kind of just there to kick it you know or i'm there just to support and lurk because it's like i might not like the game but let me go ahead and drop these numbers for them right quick so that they can be successful they can get the glow ups that they deserve and i can go work on my one pager i can go put together my powerpoint presentation I can go ahead and set up my moderation tools for the summit I'm about to run. I There's so many things you can do that don't require you to be absolutely present and shit in everyone's fucking cornflakes. Like, let me throw you on a laptop and I'll go do whatever and... There it is. It's that easy. Do I want a palm or do I want a hammer? I... Let's go for hammer. Because there's another special that I want. Why are you still alive? Oh, boo. That's more what I wanted. I think the only thing about this that sucks is if I don't have something to hit, those arrows kind of like get wild fuck none of those are what I wanted but it's whatever it's why I have 3.8 quadrillion points in the stream and I think I've actually walked 8 to 10 hours total mm-hmm there's a bunch of streams. There's one stream I watch that I watch them and I leave them on for like hours on end just to support them because I like them as a person. I have like 50,000 points in their stream. 
I will never probably use those. It'll just be posted. It'll be posted. I just noticed that I'm not wearing a belt in this photo. I just took it. I'm not sure I want to use it now. Oh, that's awkward. I hate when that happens. Or like when you have the picture and it looks super cute and everything is great. And you notice like that one hair is going the wrong direction. Or like the, the shirt tuck isn't quite right. And you're like, everything is, everything is wrong. I'm afraid this might fuck up my build. I like lurks too, but I got to have someone in the chat. I do this because I'm lonely. Oh, that's fair, Bougie King. That's fair. I was like, where are people at? Oh no, tiny chariots. Yuckers! Alright. Don't like that. I did it with the points, but also I still clicked that box for more points. <laughs> right, Vallejo? I ain't ever... Ain't ever using those points. But as soon as that box comes up and says bonus... I'm just like, oop. <laughs> I ain't ever gonna use these, but let me get these thousand points right quick. <laughs> oh, those little chariots are not my favorite. No one likes the chariots. No one likes the chariots. Not a single person. Oh, bougie, you get out of here with those 69 biddies, but thank you so much for the support. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I'm glad you got to come back by. Thank God those are dead. Is it gonna be shields? God damn it, I hate when they're shields. You know what this build needs? It needs a visit from Artemis. That's what we need is some Artemis crit. Oh, there's a chariot up there. That's not Artemis. That's Zeus. I don't care about Zeus. I could do this for every message I send in stream for like 10 streams before running out. Oh, God. I wouldn't be surprised if it was more than that, Vallejo, because I know people don't use my points that often. But I already have the points set up, so I was just kind of like... I mean, they're there. There's so many channels I'm into where people just don't even use the points. Like, the only thing I plan on doing is, since in the channel they're called caps, is making a cap uh, symbol for it, and then that's it. Pressure points. Oh, God, Akime, I want it. I need some Artemis on this. There's a streamer I watch. I have over 100,000. Need to send more messages then. Always pressure points. Pressure points is a way of fucking life, I'm telling you. People sleep on pressure points. Because they're like, oh, but other Artemis. And I'm like, you're not wrong. What the fuck is this? God, this design is so good. I'll just have a look around. Here's the fee. Mm, yeah, let's do this. Stop giving me shield, bitches. Damn, you fucked yourself up. It's kiddo, you played yourself. You standing in real bad placement. You're playing yourself all over the place. Oh, God. Y'all are both in terrible placement. Let's get some more of this. Hold on. Akime, let's talk about that for a second. 
because we had that discussion in the discord five percent crit sounds low me wishing i had a five percent chance of crit playing turn-based tabletop games five percent is one in 20 roll a d20 motherfucker i'm telling you like people sleep because they're like oh it's a five percent chance that's not great and it's like but you have to consider it's five percent on all damage you do so as long as you're pumping out damage Every single thing you're doing has a 5% chance to crit. Stack that with something like Hunter's Mark that once you crit, it spreads it like wildfire. So now everything jumps up to like a 50% chance to crit. Artemis builds get really fucking disgusting. They get real nasty real fast. There we go. That was my fault. Yeah, I'll take those. Taking a lot of silly hits. Yeah, this build is way better. Certainly, it's better than zero. Got you, Asterius. Certainly, it's better than zero. You gearing up for hitless runs on this at some point? No, I won't be doing hitless runs. I'm not interested in that, but I do like fast runs. I definitely will be speed running this. Hmm. I might do this since I'm playing sloppy. I'm not playing the greatest. Although this would stack really well because I'm throwing out my Zeus things like fucking candy. Let's do this. Mm-hmm. Let me grab these up. I hate them. Oh, you thought, bitch. Get out of my face. Um, fair play. I don't use cast enough. I can go like 10 runs and then remember that there is a whole other button to press. In the defense of in the defense of cast negligence, if your cast isn't worth it, it's not worth it. Like there are plenty of things that I've had on here if I have to wind up doing an Aphrodite cast, I will never hit B. It's okay to ignore cast if that's not a focus. It's an option. Exactly what Akume says. Uh, I once saw a guy hit Hades for 9k damage in a single crit. Mm -hmm. If you build correctly on this, anything is possible. I used to, in the older builds, there were times... There's a clip of it, actually. I was playing this in early access. It's like a year old or so. Where before they fixed Artemis to not be busted as shit... I could get to um, I could get to Lerny, and I was critting Lerny for 1,100 damage. And I was critting Lerny for 1,100 damage regularly. I mean, I just chewed through the health bar. It was just like a fucking chew toy. Just just ate it. This game seems like a lot. Eh, it can get it can get to be a bit much. It can be a bit much. I will not deny that. There's just like um the whole thing of items and stuff. 
I know plenty of people who don't even buy items. One of my mods who uh was in here earlier kind of dipped in and out. She plays and she doesn't buy items ever. Like she just doesn't bother with them. She's like, these are a waste of my time. No. There's so many things about the game that you have to realize in general are just the beauty of it is that they're options. I was like, get rid of that. Ah, chariots. Nope. Like, my build lends to it. So I'm purposely, like, wearing out my cast. Purposely wearing it down. Because literally, my cast, if I have no shards, I get a damage boost. My cast is currently damage boosted, and so it just makes sense for me to be like, okay, dump them out, keep moving. There's some mirror options where all you need to do is stick one cast, but even then I forget about it. Learning turn into lasagna. Oh yeah, if you know how to build stuff in this game, you can just straight up shred shit. You can shred shit. I want this one. Oh. No. No. Gotcha, bitch! Ooh, there's another Aphrodite. I haven't seen her in a bit. I grab the attack ups, especially in sticks. Sometimes you can carry them to the boss. Yes. You can boost them to the boss. You can get armor boosting to the boss. All types of stuff. I grab the next boon up rarity item often, but that's pretty much it. That one's a good one, too. Um, Eurydice breaks hearts because I don't think there's actually a wrong answer to Eurydice. It's really a case of what you want to see happen next. Um, What is this? We do the same pose when fishing. Good to know I'm using pro strats. Oh. <laughs> I don't have pro strats though. What do you mean? I just, I just get focused on stuff. What you got, girl? Don't care about that. And so here you go here, because this is going to add weak. So this is what I mean by thinking about this game as you go. My special is my main line of damage because I hit something and then my special just homes in on that. Quite literally, I can use this and then anything that's afflicted by weak takes more damage. I know I'm going to use my Y. That's guaranteed just extra damage. I want y'all to know that my cat is a blanket sandwich right now, and every time I look over, her toe beans are sticking progressively further out of the blanket. I need photos of the toe bean progression, please. I also use the one that gets rid of flame wheels because memes. Flame wheels are a fucking garbage tier, and I will fight them until the day I die. I hate them. I literally fucking hate them. Oh, this asshole. I mean, I wouldn't know because dude doesn't get to talk. Damn it. I hate it when they auto come back. Sometimes.
they're out. Even death doesn't like you. Shut up. Asterius is a good bull. Theseus deserves a smack right across his perfectly chiseled face. I don't even want to give him that credit, Fear Ranger. Also, hi. I don't even want to give him that credit. He just deserves, as soon as he starts speaking, he deserves nothing but L's. Just fucking punch him in his throat. Punch him in his throat. And don't feel bad about it. Punch that dude in his throat. Oh! Hey, my Dark Souls poster is here. Huh? Oh! Okay. Wait a minute. <laughs> Neon. Did you see that they're bringing that back on HBO Max? And the hype is real about that. Uh, let me see here. What does Fear Ranger say? I know, right? Yeah, God, this song is a banger. Yeah, their music is great. And then you remember you have to fight Theseus and you're just like... Everything would be great if you just stopped existing. If you could just... Not... That would be just so good. Oh, I've never seen that before. Wait. Oh, I know why I have that. I was like, what? Um, bringing what back on HBO? Uh, the Boondocks. Because Neon Sailing made a Boondocks reference. It's very one-sided. They're cons col yeah, Coliseum mates, aka boyfriends. Toxic relationship, though. I don't even know if it's a relationship. I feel like it's a relation shit. That's a T on there. Uh, Thesis, can you shut up? I'm trying to listen to this 100% certified banger. Yeah, like literally Theseus shows up and it's like that JoJo meme. That's how everyone feels about Theseus. There is not a single soul I know who is like, oh, I think Theseus is cool. It is a universal, everyone wants to just drop kick this motherfucker. Like, just stop talking all right so we got 20 minutes to get in and out of this bad boy well not quite 20 but enough that i'm gonna round it up um most of the stuff that i'm using is level two or higher That's why that's doing so much. It's a relationship. That's exactly what the fuck it is. Oh, it's time to fish. There we go. No. Mm -mm. Yep. It's a scuffer. <laughs> I don't even know what's being talked about. I just saw they're probably white, and it's like, you're probably correct. Um... <laughs> Uh, there's probably Theseus. Oh, okay. Then that follow-up? Yeah, you're right. You're 100% fucking certified correct there. Hello. A 
Let's move. Don't need to. Let's just get the hell out of here. These rocks are in the way. Ah, jeez. Oh, I'm here. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay with it. Um, let's do. I want to do the frost strike. Oh yeah, palms here are double. I saw the AOE and have Final Fantasy fourteen raid flashbacks. It's a bad version of himbo. I don't think Theseus drinks enough respect women juice to be a himbo. No, we're talking about no. Asterius is a himbo. Theseus is just a jackass. I hate the satyrs. Everyone hates the satyrs. Oh, there's a tie, actually. We were talking about it earlier. It's a tie between satyrs and rats. It's a tie between the satyrs and the rats. I'm actually doing you this. Because that helps all damage. And not just a damage. Let's do... Let's go here. It's too late for that. I'm just gonna do that one. Shivering. All right, squad. We have full health too, though. Let's go shop. Should stock up for the road ahead. I don't have any Poseidon. Why would I do that? I was say, yeah, rare crop at sticks because I'm about to fight Hades. Oh, that's awful. Rare crop in like the first level. Let's get it. Is this about to be a duo? Oh, that's not okay. Don't like that, actually. Don't like that. It charges automatically, but it's capped at 25%. Smoldering air is good? Is it really? Are y'all thinking that I should do smoldering air? Are you legit? <sighs> Ew. 
and it is the zoo is zoo sis well hang on hang on let's let's calculate this it's a one stack yeah it's a one stack call every couple of seconds the caveat would be making sure you're constantly using it i'm gonna try it i'll try it because the other choices aren't that great anyway so let's try it question it caps at 25 percent so does it do the 25 percent version or the 100 percent version because that's important too because the 100 percent and the early versions are two different versions okay we're gonna try it yeah and i gotta get the prophecy Yeah, I was going to say, because if it did the 100, that would be gross. Though the 100% is honestly just the accumulation of all of them. So that makes perfect sense. That makes perfect sense. So it's going to be Zeus lightning bolts every five seconds. I can go. The sack contains vermin. Technically speaking, it would be the same uh, difference, though. Because if you did it at 75, it only used one bar. If you did it at 100, it just depletes all four. If that makes sense. It might not. I cannot let you go, boy. Bruh, shut up. I thought I missed that one. Oh, you're gonna disappear. Yeah, that was fair. Oh, rude. They're empty on purpose, Zag. You'll be fine. That was weird. That was my fault. I have to actually make sure I'm by him, though. I feel like my damage is doing weirdness. I almost got fucked up by that. When he throws him right on top of you, it gets me shitty, though. One. Hey, Thousand Young. I'm just really focused right now. You're not wrong. Although if I'm acting like that, I will be finished. If you beat me, I'll just keep coming back. Oh, 
You know? Oh, you're holding him, that's why. Oh, almost got fucked up. I might lose this. I feel like my damage took a really weird hit. Because I've been doing well all this run. And now all of a sudden my damage is taking a really big nuke. Or is that just me? back yet Come on, I know you're gonna do that not cool bro you're not gonna give me a chance to go get those I think there's one down below and there was What if I told you I forgot I was being timed? <laughs> really, game? Please tell me I got that. God, that's terrifying. Got you, bitch. That was rough with 2 HP. Oh. My damage dropped off really poorly there at the end. Because I did really good damage all the way up to this fight. Literally. Literally my damage was fine until this specific fight. That was very bizarre. Uh, the Menace, I'm glad that they tr finally addressed it because quite literally it used to be it would cut through the beam sometimes. It would cut through the beam sometimes. What? Wait, I don't think I owe you any favors here. Well, answer me one question and I'll give it some thought. How's that? Yep. I know your question, 
I did, uh, Akime. Yeah, I got screwed over with hammers, and then my damage output towards the end there just got really bad. It just got really bad. And you can see I main the bow. So I get away when people are just like, oh, the bow, but let me stop you right there. <laughs> let me stop you right there. Charge volley, Karen, though. Woof. Woof. Oh, wait, let me grab this. I need that. Let me grab this. I feel like if I get more um, points into it too, it'll be better because I'll have more arrows that come from my special. I made it. But yeah, it literally um. Be on the frozen overlook. Await the first glimpse of the sun to your left, and onward through the cold. Sure hope this works, Nix. I use whatever is thirsty at the time. Loving the fist though. Oh, I need to try the fist still. It's the first one since I've picked it back up. I've been playing it for since day one of early access. I've seen all of it. I know everything that happens with the epilogue and whatnot. I just never came back to my file. So it's technically the first win since 1.0, but I have many more wins on this file. It's not fully leveled. GG taking it this far though. Yeah. Like I got screwed over in a lot of ways. So I pulled a lot of that out the fire. I've never actually seen people do the the walk. And then there's this shot. That thing. That's the sun. Yeah. I like how they make that part of the story. They're like, you need to stand there and await the sunset. And it's like, listen. You could have just gave us the Gen Z wallpaper and it would have been same impact. It's fine. <laughs> Support fire is nasty with a high DPS weapon. Oh, it's so pretty. I don't think I've seen all of this part though. Oh, what? Oh! you be wandering all the way out here you're trespassing on private property you know speak up every time i see persephone i can't help but see jane lynch she just looks like jane lynch to me yeah oh there's so many people i've seen who've played the entire epilogue on stream like i watched the epilogue specifically on um have coordinated his channel. Yeah, she looks like Jane Lynch. Um, you must be Persephone. My name is Zagreus, and I think I might be your son. Oh, that's awkward. What? How dare! Get out of here! Get out, or I shall make you! Out with you! Right, Kermit? They literally have the same hair.
short, I beat him finally, though he did everything he could to prevent our meeting here like this. But there's something he wanted me to tell you in the end. He said to tell you Cerberus is doing very well. Ah, uh, he told you that, did he? That's good. That's good. Though, tell me something, Zagreus. How is it that you found me? To have journeyed all this way, I scarce believe it. Zagreus? Also, peep game, her dress has pockets. Her dress has pockets. Uh, oh, it's... Guess I'm just a little tired, that's all. Not accustomed to the weather, as I think you call it. No. No, that isn't it. It's that... You cannot stay here. You can't stay here. Really, you're... <laughs> kicking me out? Why? The fates are cruel, Zagreus. You're bound to that place. Same as your father. So they would have us say goodbye. For now. My heart soars knowing you live. Then it breaks that our time together was so brief. Would you expect a goddess to settle for pocketless garments? I mean, she she is a goddess. It's like, what do you mean you can't make my dress with pockets? Do you understand that I could blink and you would evaporate? Give me pockets in my fucking dress. No, I can come back. I can come back. Now that I found you, he... Maybe he'll just let me come back. <laughs> you think your dad's a nice person? That's amazing. You tell him I demand it. And I demand he also tell me how come he, or for that matter, Nix, never sent notice that you lived. Olympus is all rife with schemers. But I was so naive to think that they were different. I'll tell him. I'll tell him. I feel awful. I... I have to go. She probably doesn't have time and day for mortal things like handbags, satchels, purses, clutches. Bitch, give me pockets. The sticks shall take you then. Oh, Zagreus. Farewell, my son. I will evaporate you. Won't you come back to me. When you are able, please come back. I shall be waiting here. However long it takes. <laughs> However long it takes. <sighs> Can't hold on. Like, how dare you expect me to carry additional shit? So yeah, for those who are just like, oh wow, you're good at this game, I'm like baby at this game, because that's my first time beating 7 Heat. Um, if you watch Half Coordinated play this, he beat, yeah, they beat it on like, I think their high score is 32 Heat. Yeah, they got all Heat rewards and then they went right back down to zero because they wanted to have fun. Which, you know, valid. Um... Thank you so much for the four month resub, King Sundu. I'm gonna read some last comments and stuff. Intoxicated Rose says, Do you think we'll get an expansion where Zagreus goes up against the fates themselves? I don't know, but what I can tell you is that there's an entire supergiant discord dedicated to this and that they're responsive on um Twitter. I had to think about that for a second. So if enough people ask, they probably could work on it. I support that 100 percent I know that Bastion had expansions, but Transistor Empire did not. So this would be another trip back. New game, no mirror stuff could be as hard as high heat. Yeah, no mirror is harsh. You mate, boy. Have you any idea what time it is? No. Wait, what? I vanquished you in single combat and finally found mother, and that's all you have to say to me. <laughs> Nonsense. Don't you think I would recall such an event? Wait. You can't be serious. You're going to pretend as though it never happened. She wants answers, same as I do. She demands you let me pass. Let me go to her again. Silence. This discussion is over. I hardly think this is the time or place to indulge your overwrought imagination. I know where we can continue this discussion. 
discussion then. <laughs> I found her, sir. My mother, she's alive and well, and uh, but I just couldn't stay up there for very long. I have to get back to her. Silence gaslighting Hades, right? A three-part boss fight with the Weaver sisters would be amazing. I think that would be dope. You really made it all the way. You must have gone past your father. That's amazing, lad. Oh wait, she was, she was great. Nothing like father, more like you a little bit, I guess. Though being on the surface, it just seemed to suck the life right out of me, even without the wretches of the underworld trying to do me in. State two denial. Then you had a little time at least. Sounds like you had unfinished business with her there. You got to her this once. Surely you're able to again, isn't that right? All the lighting in the world be powered by gas. It is. I had to speak with her. Oh, that's songs. I was like, what? I only have these left. And I know that I have side quests to do. Oh, I need to turn in my fish. Your father fell to you as once his father fell to him. Although you were substantially more merciful. And I know it is a bitter victory at best. Though, tell me, what transpired subsequently that you have returned? Did you locate your birth mother? I did. I, she was there. She was where you said she'd be, and more than I imagined, but I had so little time with her. I can't survive up there for very long. Why didn't you tell me I'd just die no matter what? Oof. Oh, my child. I say this seldomly, but I did not know, or I did not wish to believe, that the service would have such an effect on you. But it seems you share your father's fate, after all. My father's fate? But he is smugly waiting for me every single time I make it there and seems quite healthy by then, all in all. Though, maybe the farther we get from this realm, the worse we get. Has he cast his lot, inheriting the underworld? So I now presume... You are God, Nyx is a mood. ...by powers greater even than mine. Tell me something. If you knew that you could only see Persephone for but a moment's time, would you still make the journey to her there? It's fine, Vallejo, because I'm getting ready to end. I wouldn't be surprised if that's OBS too. Then go and ask them, child. Steady your resolve and find her there again. And use well what brief time you have with one another whilst you can. As mortals do. As mortals do. Yeah, like I said, I'm getting ready to end, so I'm not gonna be too particularly invested in troubleshooting it. Yeah, that's OBS then. It's been OBS this entire time. It's it is a known issue, and the alternatives is trying to use slobs, which is still OBS based, or using um X split, which I've never even touched. Even more candles. I, Neon, I've said this so many times. Do a plushie or fucking riot. If I don't get an email before, like, my birthday next year saying that they've released Deuce plushies, I'm gonna fight a motherfucker. Square up. Fucking fight me, nerd. Oh, uh, yes, I made it pretty far. On that account, you heard correctly, Deuce. But, turns out I have unfinished business here, so... I, I want like to time time. I want to do some plushie that's like this round boy I need this but with Dusa this but Dusa someone clip this and send it to Supergiant this but Dusa I need her to be small and round and be friend I need it I literally need it Oh god, you got the Tizo. I'm so jelly. I need a Dusa orb. I need the Dusa orb. Also, thank you so much to whoever got me the supersonic orb. It was a stream gift. I know who got me. I know who got me this orb. I know who got me this orb, but I do not know who got me this orb. So this one I know the gifter, but not this one. But I have both.
That was me? It was you? Thank you so much. I said anonymous, so I didn't know who to thank. But I need a Dusa orb. Two is better than one. It's true. It's true. But now consider three. <laughs> All right, let's do a few more dialogues and then we're gonna get out of here. Especially since OBS is just shitting all over the floor. Oh my God, I love you, Dusa. It is. It's both okay and great. <sighs> Cuteness. This is my latest hole. Mhm. Mm Got some soda. I'm hoping more uh, Hades merch is incoming. Oh, it better be. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, Vallejo. And a uh, fun fact, if you go back to maybe even the last four or five versions, you get the same issue. You get the same issue. So rolling back doesn't resolve it either. Like I said earlier to people who still are trying to tro tro troubleshoot it, I'm not going to lose sleep over it because yeah this is obs side and they know that millions of people use their fucking software if they want me to sit here and expend hours trying to fix it they need to give me money or something because i'm not going to fix their fucking shit for them they need to figure it the fuck out and this is all stuff that's happened recently and multiple people are reporting it i'm not gonna sit here and waste my time and energy when i have like 800 other things to do on it it just sucks because it kills my stream quality so, with that being said, Twitch has a software out, but it's pretty basic. Oh, God. That's awkward. Um, Thank you so much, everybody, for hanging out. I appreciate you. Sorry for at the end it started going to shit. I've been seeing it as we got closer to the six-hour marker that it started doing weird stuff, like in terms of my frame rate and shit. I would not touch that Twitch software when it's in football. I mean, considering we see what happened with the whole soundtrack thing. But yes, thank you so much everybody for hanging out. I appreciate you. I'm just dropping off some quick commands in there as some reminders. We are sponsored by Blue Microphones. We are part of the Blue Mic crew. We are powered by Blue. We are sponsored by Dryat T. If you use the uh, code TWISTED10 at checkout, you can go ahead and get 10% off your order when you order loose sleep tea from there. And they're good for double steeps, as people have pointed out before. Um, I'm a humble partner. Use my link, get cheap games, help charity, help your favorite streamers. Any and all profits and revenue that I make off of Twitch are going to go into my streaming setup and into making things better. The final thing on my agenda is a new camera. And then after that, we're going to probably be good for a while. All my designs and overlays I do myself. Um, once that's hit, we're going to be do bleh, we're going to be moving all of our money to charity and we'll try to do it monthly. So with that being said, but you need Elgato software, but oh God, that sounds tiring. A two PC setup. What's going on with the camera? Oh, nothing. I just want to upgrade it. I want one that looks a little less pixelated when I'm like in these large screens and stuff. I want a little bit better integrity. I've got better lighting. I've got better lighting. I have my sexy mic that I love a lot, a lot, a lot. And then, um, sorry, I came onto Twitch. Okay, I have to explain this before I go. I was getting ready to find someone for a raid, right? And I always open up the second tab to make sure they're actually live. And when I opened it, on the front page right now in the hero slot is music, right? But I just wasn't ready for it to be like rap slash trap music. So it literally loaded and the first thing I saw was this chick that was on the floor twerking and it just caught me off guard. Cause I was like, whoa, that's in the hero slot? Wait, 
That's in the hero slot? Oh, I feel like someone's about to get fucking lambasted. It just, it just caught me off guard. Cause like, I, I love rap and I like, uh, I like trap music too. It just, it just caught me off guard is all. I didn't expect it to load and see Cheeks right there was like, wow, first thing loading. That's bold. That's a bold move, Cobb. Um. Somebody's going to get cursed out. Someone's gonna get cursed out. Oh, let's do a roundabout raid. Let's do a roundabout raid. <laughs> Selene, in the side view, cheeks, but also Orpheus's lament is gorgeous. I just came back, what happened? Oh, I was talking about how I was trying to find somebody to raid. And like 100%, I just wasn't ready to see like straight up booty butt cheeks on the front page, front and center. Like that just caught me off guard. I figured if it was going to be front page, it would be like at least second or third slot. No, they gave that the hero slot. That's awkward considering, you know, they asked me to be on front page and I have to make sure like I'm PG. I'm just like, okay, cool, 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 cool. All right, now let's get out of here. We're going to go to Urban. He's playing some Animal Crossing, hanging out. Also, he raided me at the start of my stream, so now I have to raid him into his stream. Thank you so much, everybody, for hanging out. I appreciate you. Like I said, we'll be back Wednesday with... I don't know. I don't know. We might play Iconoclast. We might play Blasphemous. I'll have to sit down and, and hammer it out, because there's a bunch of things that are options in the backlog. It's really going to depend on how many games I want to beat in November. I might try to beat two games, so... Or I might do one chunky game. Be safe, everyone. If you're doing trick-or-treat things, please be safe. Wear your mask, social distance, all that good stuff. Or be like all the other cranky adults in the room and just, you know, buy a big-ass bag of candy for yourself. For yourself. Love the shirt. Straight out of Nibelheim. Why, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, Let's go hang out with Urban. Thank you everyone for hanging. I appreciate you. Have a good rest of your day, yeah?